Good Hello. morning, everybody. Welcome Ooh. back to um, mm -mm. Yogscast live streams. Today, me and Doug are going to pick up our Divinity Original Sid 2 playthrough yep. uh, from last time. We are smashing through the... Um, the we just got out of Fort Joy. The first we are island. Free it's free to roam the island. Crazy. Like, I've never felt more powerful. <laughs> um, because playing this with four people means there's a lot more... People die. Mostly your, your guy's just a lot weaker. Yeah. And so you die more. But you can do less in each, in each round. Which is part of the game. Um, let's get you connected. I have to do this again. Mm. Let's join. All right. How do I, how do I invite, invite you? Duncan is back on the shit computer. No, he fixed it. This is, this is the... Um, the glitchy computer, but... It's also the most powerful machine in the office. Apparently. Yeah. Because they had to borrow it the other day to play something, because they needed a really powerful machine. But Sam came in and said, they're all the same. I don't know why they picked that one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Mm. Hello, everyone. Hello. Duncan Carey. That's basically what this... this what this... Um, what this... What divinity well, it's series. more like incarnate Carey. It's you're carried by your dude. Unless What's you name? shoot it. <laughs> yeah, which can happen. <laughs> yeah. I'm here to sabotage um, Duncan. I know, you're, you're like four shots of the crossbow do a crazy amount of damage now. You can pretty much one, one shot someone. Yeah. In a turn. Once I've got to take a whole turn, getting in kind of up and running, you can just knock someone out instantly. Um, are you joining Nang? If, if you invite me. No, yeah. I, pressed, I pressed accept. Hmm. I'll try again. Hmm. So is it me or is this resolution looking a bit weird? You might have to join on me. The resolution does look off, yeah. Hmm. Looks like it's on the wrong resolution. You click definitive edition. <laughs> I did. Why? I don't know. It just doesn't seem to be working. I'm in it. I'm in the game. Ish connectivity issues, guys. This is why we. This is why we turn up early, well prepared. Join for, game for all. Hmm. Oh, you're a woman now. I mean, you're, you're, you're a sexy game. human woman. Oh yeah. <laughs> How strange I am. You, you change your. So you can click into any of those. What's your human ratio now? This encourage. Yeah. What does it do? Gives uh, everyone plus one strength, finesse, intelligence, and two con. Hmm, that's not bad. Yeah, I think it works for everyone. Or maybe just it's just a one person thing. Being a um there's certain racials that are good, like if you're an elf, you um you can like do this I think it's called like flesh sacrifice where you you damage yourself to give yourself an extra Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Action point. I remember that quite a big case. deal. Oh, is it working? Player joined? Is that you? I quit the game and then join straight from the Steam menu. Player joined. Maybe. Man, you look hot. I like your tattoos. Thanks. Does it, does it give you just a I'm random... In. Oh, I need to change our... Um, yeah. I'm the bone man. Actually, we're both bone men, but you're a hot lady bone man. So there is a way, I think... I'm usually a weird lizard bone man. According to bone chat, wolf. there is a... We, so we've got two characters. We both have lone wolf. That's right. Uh, Duncan's playing the sexy lady. I am gonna be. I'm. I'm just a bone man, an elven bone man. To be fair, range. if you find one of these things as well, you can also do this. Well, there. Well, but you'll be a man. There is. There are, well, there's no second one in the game. Oh really? That is it. But oh. you can craft a new one. I think. Yeah, there we go. Out with, faces. Because I'm collecting um, faces. I think you need a source. One, two, three. A four, some sort of five, source six, seven, thing. Seven. So far, I've got ten people. No, eleven people's faces. Yeah, I'm not sure. I wish I was an auto sort on this bag. It's, uh, no. Mm. <laughs> I suppose you guys are using the thief cheese to get skills. We we work, we don't know what that is. We're not. No. You need a source orb and one of each race's face. Okay. Um, five source orbs and one of each. Face. Five source orbs. Yeah. Well, I don't even know what source orbs are. I think they're a later game thing. So apparently, like this game gets Literally auto ramps sort up button pretty hardcore. Right but where? Where? Oh. Up there. Hey! Thanks, chat. There you go. Look, see, now it's nicely organized. All so the you, faces apparently you can right-click on things to mark them as oh, got an unidentified trash. 
and then you can so for example that thing that dagger nose cutter if you <laughs> mark cutter. that as trash or vendorable then when you go to the when you go and buy something add to wares it's called so if you like mark these things as wares when you go to the shop mm. Um, you can just click add all wares and it will throw everything in there that you don't want out of your inventory. Apparently that's a cool. Thing. I might keep that. Yeah. But apparently, the, is there like a quicker way to mark something as wares that isn't so incredibly tedious? Yeah. Is there like a hotkey chat? Don't know. Giving you knowledge. Sh quick trash is shift left click. Shift ah, okay, left. There you go. Shift left. Thank you, chat. Look, see, now I can mark all these things. Oh, shift left. Left click this chub fish. Foul trousers. Okay. Crumpled. All these notes and books, honestly, I'm, I'm just clogging up my inventory. I do, do not need. And I, But there's a lot of crafting in this game, right? And mm. so, for example, this here, a short stick, if I can, if I combine this short stick with, like, a knife or something like this, I think I can just cut that into... Arrow shaft. So you go, look, bam. See, I now have four arrow shafts. So you need to have occasionally like a sharp object. Right. Um, and arrow shafts are handy because you can obviously then make um, other stuff out of them. Yeah, but that's recipes. Nails, I think you can put those on your boots. If you haven't combined your boots with nails, you should do that. Uh, okay. Just because... Um, My leather boots. In future. Combining them with... Where's the... Oh, wait. Yeah, in future you might you might need that. Painting of a relic. Shift left click. Okay. Where do you combine them? Um, you combine them in. You just right click on your boots and say combine with. Mm -hmm. And they, they, then you just stick some nails in there. Um, combine. Bam! That will stop you slipping over. Nailed boots. Immune to slipping. That's, That's actually good. quite a big deal. Yeah. Because. You never know when you're going to be fighting some horrible, fucking, terrifying, undead slip, slip monster in an icy cave that's going to slip you over. It's happened to me a lot. I've slipped over a lot in this game, and oh my god, <laughs> it's very annoying. Uh, a mortar and pestle, look at that. That's probably useful. I could probably like grind up some teeth or something in it. That would probably make like tooth dust. No, it doesn't, doesn't do that. Um, <coughs> Druid Nay, have I got any like drugs I can grind up? I want to want to see if I can grind up some drugs. So now I've got I've got the flesh sacrifice ability now because I'm an elf. Yeah, that's useful to know, isn't it? God, I look weird as an elf though. Apparently, elves. I also have animals around them. <laughs> oh, is that your armor? I guess so, but like when I'm like a human or a dwarf, I look like I've got this green stuff with my boobs showing. I think that might just be the armor. But then, isn't the same as a dwarf, though? I mean, so. Oh, do you know, is it to do with the face that you use to oh, make the... Similar gear, isn't it? Is it? Well, do you reckon that's the faces that she used to make that mask were those bodies? Do you see what I mean? Oh. So if you make a new mask out of different faces, you'll look like those people's bodies. Maybe? Question mark? Mm. Knife plus tooth equals shocking arrowhead. You're kidding me. Shocking. A shocking app. What is that? Is that actually a thing, chat? Scoots. I'm interested. Um, yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm the worst. Sorry, chat. Yeah, if you leave sub messages, I, I don't read them very often. I'm bad. Like Lord Dragos. Hi, Yorkscast with love from Australia. Hey, Australia. Okay. He checked in. James Duncan subbed on Twitch Prime. Thank you. And Sir Pugglesworth. There you go. Look, I've, I've done them, chat. Look, I'm doing it. Any knife plus <laughs> a tooth. The fuck? Any knife plus a tooth. That seems like well, that quite, carve, quite an expensive. It carves a tooth arrow. into a shocking arrowhead. That's fucking amazing, guys. Holy <laughs> shit. Any more? Do you got any more recipes for me? Because that is nuts. We should go and buy lots of cheap knives. Mm. You can just use any old sword you're carrying as a knife. Mm. Any sharp object, like this sword. I've got a few faces to, to cut here. What about a claw? Can I sharpen a claw? No. <laughs> Anymore, sorry. Lewis, save all the arrowheads and arrow shafts. Later, you combine them with honey to make charming arrows, which is the best. Okay, so I need to get honey. Neon Frog says, if one of you talks to a skill vendor, the other person can steal from that vendor while they are busy talking. <laughs> oh, my God. After you steal the skill book, make sure to learn it straight away. Otherwise, you'll get caught. Easy way to get free skills. Lol. <laughs> that feels fucking OP as hell, Neon Frog. <laughs> 
<laughs> um, the mask just uses the default body to the race you pick, says Lord Trey. Oh, okay. B45 Quantum, Lewis, I want to, I might, I want to get this game, but is there a difficult learning curve? I've played like 25, 20 minutes and it sucked. Well, apparently, I played this game before with period and sips. It was horrible. It's really tough. We died all the time. It was brutal. But apparently, if you just play Summoner with one of your classes, you can use the, the spell which Duncan will show you now. Um, and you just fucking one shot everything in the world. Because it's ridiculous. Nah. Now, apparently, they nerfed the Incarnate quite heavily as well in the latest patch. Um, and so it's a lot worse than it used to be. Oh, and maybe nice. it doesn't like, maybe it doesn't like carry very well through. There's some skeletons. Yeah, like send. There you go. You're in combat. So here they come. Go for it. You're now an elf with a bow. Yeah. Which is what I am, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am change. actually an elf with a bow. Well, I'm an undead elf though. But it would be nice to be a real not undead elf, dead elf at one some point. But I can wait. Hmm. So Duncan buffs this guy up like twice, um, and then this is this is just I think that's just a regular incarnate. But when you've got ten in summoning, no, this is a, this is the it turns one. into the advanced one. Oh no, but is he just a default one? Which what did you summon him in? Just man, but he's still yeah. So he's the he, so basically if you summon him in a specific he's still the champion now. flavor of pool, he will. I can't see what's going on. What are you doing? No, it keeps going over here because there's some shooting. There you go. Change the camera angle. And there was someone shooting me from from up there. There's an undead decomposing assassin behind oh. you. Not for long. Oh, wow. Tank that. No, don't move. Oh, you idiot. So, you, <laughs> so in this game, you have to be very careful with your clicks because if you click on someone, but they're car but they're like they've got an animation, yeah. and they animate out of your click, it will fuck up. I think there should be some kind of magnet system. <laughs> Very common, but you can easily misclick in this game. Mm -hmm. uh, so, but there's oil here. I'm gonna pick that up, put it on my bow. I'm gonna cast a spell on you to make you less less be dead and make you even more less powerful. Be dead. And then I'll just join you in shooting this guy to death for insane Ow. damage. He's Look at dead. that. Um, cool. That's new. The new bow you got, right? Is it good? Yeah, it looks. It's good. nuts. It's actually really. Apparently, this rolled really, really well. You're looking for a bow with plus 10 to 20% critical chance mm -hmm. and plus finesse, which is literally what it has. That's mad. Um, and it's got plus water damage as well. So, yeah, apparently it's just an amazing bow. I didn't realize this, but... Yeah, a whisperer. Okay. Um, all in. That, that was your all in. I'm, I'm sad for you. Could someone get Pyrian to unban me? No. <laughs> Summoning 10 makes it do your crazy amount of damage. It does. But I mean, it's not going to get. Apparently, it does get better. Yeah, with it does. More yeah. points in well, it summoning. It scales with my level as well. Okay. I mean, that's always useful. But it doesn't, like, upgrade any further. But I think there are more spells you can cast on it. Um, There's one spell I saw in a list somewhere that was, what, Soul, soul Bond or something like that? Or Soulmate? Mistress Meep says, <laughs> have they got the teleport gloves? Yes, we have. They're very easy to get hold of, and teleportation is one of the strongest spells in the game. So wearing those gloves until you get like um, a, a spare point that you can throw in Aero or Hydra Aerothurge to, to learn it yourself is useful. There's a bunch of spells that are very, very powerful, and, and the ones that are very, very powerful are ones that allow you to sort of control the, the battlefield a little bit. So obviously, apparently, when you play this sort of harder difficulties... Um, oh, he dodged. Um, it's it's easier if you um, have ways to crowd control people. Right. Or, like, or, or a teleport is a good way of crowd controlling, like a yeah. warrior, because you just teleport him away and he has to spend ages running back to you. Um, you guys, yeah, you can always respec if as well, like at the end of the first island. Um, sorry, so yeah, Lydia's not very well. She's got some sort of... Influenza or something, and she's actually in hospital. Um, well, she was, I don't know if she's out now, so that's why Duncan's here covering with me instead. But honestly, I just want to get this game played because I've not seen past really the first island. It took a long time for me and Sips and Pflax to get any decent distance through this game. How far did you get in the end? Not far beyond the first island, I don't think. We played a bit on the new zones, I think we got to a snowy bit. Okay. I never got that far. 
I quit after the first island. Yeah, it felt like it was enough. Do you know what yeah. I mean? There's so much value in this game. How do I... Um, ah, oh, there we go. I need to... Uh, I've got this belt. 10% earth resistance and 10% poison resistance. Did we kill those don't guys? Really want that, I mean, I, d I barely did poison anything resist. in that, did I? I just, I'm shot, dead. I just shot... Um, yeah, you didn't do nothing. No, you, you shot some marrows. I don't know. It's, that was an easy fight. I'm going to go back to being a skeleton lizard. Oop. There we go. I'm back. I'm back, baby. I'm back, baby. I'm interested in what people think um, we should be playing as, because Duncan can obviously... We can both put some points into something. We can both try anything, really. Yeah, I was going to do a bit of necromancy, I think. Necromancy is fun. I, 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 I mean, I think you have to sort of pick something that seems to work with your... Um, Ooh. Orders from Dallas. Got some orders from Dallas, mate. Let's have a look. Da, da. From the desk of her ladyship, Dallas. Right hand to the Bishop Alexander, son of the divine. There will be no more excuses. <laughs> it's like a sermon. <laughs> How is it that you have not crushed this rebellion yet? For your own sakes, you'd best find and dispose of these the dregs of these seekers before you meet the same end as Atsu Atusa. Yeah, Atusa, you remember her? Yeah, she They killed her. They pieces. executed her. They, cut, they, they made her cut out her tongue. Yeah. She did. And then, and and then, then they, they still killed her anyway. Her. That's pretty rough. <laughs> it's a bad way to the go. The Source King's weapons are no, no good if the Seekers lay hands on them first. The Source King's weapons? The Source King, is that Brachus Rex? Could be. Should we go and find his cave? I think they were, uh, were obviously looking... So these Seekers were like the rogue group of sorcerers who rebelled against Dallas. And obviously she sent all these magists out after them, but they all got killed by these decomposing yeah. undead boys. I guess we want to go the other way, Duncan. <laughs> like, deeper. Uh, so, yeah. That's what we've just done is kind of wander around. And Ames has reported the Seeker movement to the south and east of the bridge leading out of Fort Joy. So that's where the Seekers are. Should we go and find the Seekers? Yeah. There you go. you just got a quest thing done. Mm. Just popped up. Seek and you shall find. So find the seek. South and east. So it's we need to go through this way. So come back to where I am. And All I'll right. Meet you. I just stepped on a fire trap anyway and oh. nearly killed myself. I think there's like the flaming pigs and stuff around this way, which we is don't want to go to. There should be a way this. Oh, no. It's no way. Can we get up there? Oh, yeah, there's some vines. Look. Oh. Here we go. Hey. Oh, what's this? Like a secret way. What's this? What are these blue noxious bulbs? Well, it does say blue noxious bulbs. Oh, this is like a... St oh, okay, this is dodgy. There's a treasure chest there, but it looks dodgy, Duncan. Well, why don't you teleport it back to the start? Did you just hear something? There's an incinerated corpse with, a se with several severed heads. Okay. Could you see seven yeah, heads yeah, everywhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a bit spooky. But if you teleport that chest back to here, we can open it safely. It does look mysterioso. Hey. Ow. Oh, there's, there's electricity. Oh, jeez. Ow. Yeah. I'm taking the stuff. <laughs> Maybe it should have been further than that. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> it's like a trap, I think. Run. I think we just need to bide our time. I think it's happening automatically. What was in the treasure chest? Uh, I didn't check yet. I've gone past it. There we go. Just I'm, press. I'm, I'm free. Press I. And it should, the ones, the things that you looted so are we, in, or got, got some boxes boots, around them. Some laced scale boots. There we go, legit. They're not bad. Do you want those? Give you a bit more physical armor. Okay, you know, send to Salty Boneman. And there's a dwarven staff, an air staff, which is still not as good as my crossbow. Plus it does magic damage. I can't, yeah, so I want to stick to doing physical damage so that we can combo uh, together. Yeah. My shit's green. Uh, okay, well, I've <laughs> keep, keep coming the one this way. We, we'll find the Seekers this way, I think. All right. Southeast, yeah. It's a good thing we've got some magic armor, or else we'd have been, like, stunned and like, all sorts of stuff. So magic armor protects you from status effects, which is a pretty big deal. Um, I vaguely remember there being a massive fight here that lasts forever. Yeah, there's various fights. That yeah, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one. This has got worms. Boy, this is, like, some, some worms. Yeah. Ones. Yeah, I'll just um, I'll just get some. Because they come in waves, they just keep coming. I'll just get some fire on my arrows. 
and I'll buff you. Now, do you do full fire damage now? No. You don't? Okay. Maybe. Uh, I think shoot, I do... Shoot. No, I add yes. 10 to 11 fire damage to weapon attacks. Okay, so it's not still not worth really me going magic. I think I might be a scoundrel, like a sneaky, a sneak boy. If I be a, a half, a half, like if I put scoundrel skills in. Should I go fire incarnate or should I stay with regular? Well, I think blood? fire looks like it'll work on oil. oil, blood, anything. I go with anything. Whatever, whatever takes your fancy. I don't think these guys are going to be immune to anything. We're not fighting genies or. I know, but have they got? They haven't got any armor. Okay, so I've fine. been playing here as Might Magic Three again. Oh my god, what a hard game! <laughs> like. I'm so bad at it, it turns out. Like, there's this huge community of mostly like Russians who play Heroes of Might and Magic. And they fucking love that game. And I love that game. But like, I just can't believe how bad I am. I've talked to Rhythian about it as well, because Rhythian's a huge Heroes of Might and Magic fan. He watched uh, me and Ben's stream, and he was like, oh, you guys made loads of mistakes. You should have just, <laughs> you should have just got Vampire Lords upgraded to those, and you would have had no problem. And I was like... I had no idea. I don't. I didn't know what's. Well, I didn't know what was good because I kind of was quite. What's I the played vampire it, lord? Played it when I was a kid. Vampires, me lord. And you know, I just. Is anyone in chat like? Do you guys remember? I bet you. I think it's chat. It's like there's always someone in chat who's like played a game for like a million hours. Yeah. It's like yeah, I've played a bit. Here is my magic. Like four thousand hours. Yeah. It's so. like number two in the world. Um, Scooter says you do play on the hardest difficulty and the AI tends to cheat on that difficulty excessively. Eh. Eh. Um. Whoa! Oh, I just spilled some water on the board. Oh shit. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Steve, can I get a can I get a um <laughs> Steve? I just spilled some water on my keyboard, Steve. It's alright, don't worry. Can I just get some blue <laughs> blue blue roll? It's fine, I've cleaned the I've cleaned the keyboard out. You know, it's all the Don't worry. It's alright, it wasn't very much, just a little bit. Mm. How old am I, Steve? I'm 35 years old. It's easier to spill. Going on 12, Steve. I remember once I spilled beer on my laptop keyboard. Fortunately, I don't really have to do much in this game. <laughs> Doug could just fucking kills everything. I, so yeah, I spilled beer on my laptop keyboard. I haven't actually had to have and a turn I, up I till took, now. I was taking the laptop keyboard off the laptop because I needed to um, clean it out. And then as I took it off, I spilt beer again underneath it <laughs> right. into the laptop. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, TJ. Cheers, dude. Sorry, man. Oh, how embarrassing. Don't worry. It's only water. I think the water won't damage the keyboards if you, like, have them, like... It's still yeah, go, you know. I know. I got... <laughs> I still, it doesn't matter that my keyboard <laughs> sucks and I can't do anything. I'm taking it slow. I might play, might play better now. Uh, I didn't spill any down any of the holes or anything, Steve. I just managed, I managed to keep it fairly contained. I was hanging out with Barry and chatting, chatting to him about the schedule yesterday and talking to Nina as well. And um, while I was doing that, Nina just spilled an entire cup of coffee in her keyboard. <laughs> <It's> like, lol. <laughs> <laughs> and she didn't know what to do because she'd clearly never done it before. And I was like, just turn it over, turn it over. Oh, and she's such a clean freak as well. And she was like, but I've cleaned it up. And I was like, but turn it over. And she turned it over and it poured out like <laughs> a quarter of a cup of coffee. I was like, what were, what were you planning on doing? Like so letting that air dry inside the keyboard. If I've, have you ever put something like really horrible and sticky on a keyboard and just been like, this is ruined, right? I thought that my keyboard was completely ruined once, so I just decided to put it in the dishwasher. I was like, well, it can't get any worse than it is. Let's see what happens. So I put it in the dishwasher, came out, left it like a week, worked perfectly. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> sure. So you just once it's fully dried, it just works. <laughs> and it was like a, it was like a proper like. Lit up one with like backlighting and everything, just worked. Ixtab and the Peach are in chat. <laughs> I thought they were the. I thought Ixtab was the Peach. I thought you guys were the same person, because before the Peach was like, "Can I get a donation <laughs> for Ixtab?" Oh, I guess I guess you're not the same person. You're just friends. How do you guys know <laughs> each other? I did put my earphones uh, in the washing machine like the other day. Says Ixtab. Don't don't do that. They'll probably be fine. Oh my god, Peach was just being nice. Oh my god, I thought it was like I thought you were like trying to. Oh, you are different people. That's nice to know. That's good to know. I thought you guys were the same person. I thought, because some people were like, have 
like multiple usernames. Like Duncan has. Whoa. What is your username? Like Lalna, DJ Coffee, Living Coffee. Coffee. Like you've got all these different like names that don't make any sense. You don't even drink that much coffee. You're not like a big coffee fiend, are I you? Just finished a coffee. Well, I had a coffee this morning, but you know. I drink a lot of coffee, Lewis. Okay. Did, coffee. did you come to the? You didn't come to the cupping with us, did you? No, I was, I was away. Would you have liked to have cupped your, been cupped? Uh, I don't know, really. What's this fireball I've got? It's Ooh. just um, it doesn't go very far. from your incarnate. I know it does. Can I hit this? Come on, come on. I think you can if you just, there you go. There. Fireball! <laughs> Whoa, there's lots of oil everywhere, which is kind of fun. You're right, this was the fight that went on for ages. Because, because they, they keep kept, coming, yeah. They kept coming. But you got so much XP because each one gives you a thousand. We've already leveled up. Have we? Yeah. I didn't even spend my points from last time. Maybe I should start just whacking points and stuff and experimenting. You get another thousand. People are saying pyro might be a fun thing to do. Yeah, I mean, that would be cool because then I could make a fire elemental. We could go all fire and me like... I do hate coffee. That's right, guys. But unfortunately, um, I've run out of my nice tea. The new, the new beans are really good. If not Like the one you had I now. put those in there. Does that taste yeah, good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that... Well, they were the ones I liked the most from the cup. Yeah, yeah. But right. what I've done is I just basically have like a coffee milkshake with oat milk. Oh. Um, I found that I can tolerate coffee a lot more if... It doesn't taste like coffee. It does, yeah, if it's sweeter and has oat milk. I drink mine black without sugar. Just bam. Easy. Don't have to worry about doing anything. Just pour it in a cup and drink it. Oh, shit. I attacked a voidling. And there was another voiding in front of it. <laughs> I shot that and it died. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is so straightforward. Oh my god! I love playing this game on like easy mode. I remember play. I remember this fight. I remember just being stressed and. Tense. We're not playing it on easy. We mode. Were, like, we're playing it on the, the the same difficulty. We're not playing it yeah. on. We're not playing it on hard. We're not playing it on tactical. It's normal. Whatever. We're this playing it what, on. This is what I played it at. Last See, they've played. got this. They've got. They, the, there is a difficulty setting called tactician, and what they did was they took all the people who played the beta and used the tactics. They basically like used the tactics that they had. Um, they basically used like every 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 tactic that people used to kill these things. They they said like, no, that doesn't work. We're gonna un, we're gonna make it hard. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry if that doesn't make any sense. Um, but basically, it's, it's like a clever. It's, we're not playing on that difficulty. We're playing on normal. Hard difficulty setting. It is. It is a tough game. It, it was a tough. It's, game. it's unforgiving, but like, like it's crazy. Um, anyway, oh, we're doing I'm it. In this guy. All right, this will be fine. I think I've given the keyboard a nice wash. Um, excellent news. Stomp, stomp. Did I get stomp. a text off you this morning? Me? No. Um, did I? I think we need to chat about when we're doing. Oh, that's Shin. Yeah, we're doing the old, the old Sev Tech. It's afternoon stuff. Mm. Um, Deck. Is who still alive? Uh, there's one Voidling next to you. Oh, well, I could just shoot it, can I? If I have the right angle. Boom. There Damn, we, we did it. Is that it? Are they all dead? It looks like it. Nice. So I guess we can put points in our levels now. That voice. Yeah, so I've got two points available. Hmm, let's go for... So now I've got I've got my Geomancer point, and that's good. I, I want to get one of Necromancer. But then I've got Blood blood Rain as well. That's Necromancer. Which is... No, it's not. It's Hydro... Hydro Sophist and Necromancer. So, okay, so I need at least one point in Necromancer. So let's go that now. Oh, I didn't realize Blood Rain was a combination. Yeah. Hmm. Because it's Rain and Blood... So blood water and, and water and, and yeah. blood. Necromancer, okay. Points in Necromancer done. I've got a, I'm going to put a point in Persuasion. Okay. I'm doing it. It's because all the times I failed. And here. I'm, never, I'm not really sure where my point should go on this bit. What does chat think? Well, obviously. Is it just all intellect? Well, I mean, you're not really casting intellect based spells, are you? That's what I'm thinking, but does that what what affects my infusions, my uh, incarnates? Um, I think it's just cast a level and summoning ability. It says there. I think um, it certainly doesn't help for 
um, you said it said doesn't hurt for you to have like some things in memory, because then you can have more spells on your hotbar. That's bar. a good point. But you can always respect member. So if you, if you put something in the wrong place, like you find, look, if you press K. I've got two slots left already. Wow. Because I put a point in memory already. But it might be that I've got some from gear too. I'm not sure. Maybe. Wow. Uh, what does okay. it say? Well, no, don't worry then. What does wits, Lone Wolf plus what does two? wits do? Wits, crit, crit, crit chance, and initiative. Detect traps and find hidden treasures. Hmm, hidden treasures. What we not used to be in undead livings? Why does the skeleton have a breathing animation? Yeah, that's, that's good. Good point. <laughs> yeah, that is interesting. I think it's because if you were, if you just stood there, st stock still, it would look weird. I think that might be it. I might put a point in wits just because I haven't yet. <laughs> Boom. Got another one available. Mm. Oh. Yeah, there's some some pigs that are on fire. Apparently, you need like two points in persuasion, according to chat, to. I've only got one. Talk to them. But maybe when we level up again, I get another one. I think I've looted all of these fucking worms. I don't think there was anything useful actually in them, apart from a load of intestines. So really just FYI, um, there's a few messy areas around here. Have you seen? Can you loot these things now. Okay. They're all burned. What was the story behind that bit? Well, so this is the the void things are starting to like be attracted to the the source again, I guess. Because this is what attacked the boat, isn't it? Yeah, these voidlings. They just sort of came out all over the place. Oh, beehive. So there's a beehive up here with nothing in it. Oh, there's a there's fire lizards. Oh shit, there's a dead void salamander it's and a can, noxious void salamander. Have you quit saved? I remember these being hard, but I reckon we're just kind of just destroy them instantly. So can we get down? Oh, it's this way. Conjure. Oh, too late. The king calls you home, unliving one. Swear to him, or the void swallows you. All right, sure. I love how like animals can talk. Oh right, I, me I remember the poison being a problem, but I guess it's not. Oh no, it's acid. Ooh, does acid hurt us? Uh, acid does. Yes, destroys physical armor each turn. Ooh, but also but it is healing too. you. Okay, that's fine. So I suppose. Oh, it's my turn. Mm. Well, let's just um, fuck up these guys, I guess. Hey, how you doing? I'm not going to put poison I remember there, not being able to do this fight, by the way, until later on. <laughs> right. Well, that one's almost dead already. <laughs> let's make a... Don't make a poison one, because it'll probably heal them. Oh, right, yeah. What can we get? What can we get from a pool? That one's probably right to poison. What do we make there? Anything? Um, I think that might just be a shock one. Electrified, Electrified water. water. That'll do. Oh, that was a totem. Okay, whoops. Well, I don't know if you can squeeze a big boy in there as well. <laughs> <laughs> just <laughs> <laughs> busting out of the ground. Why not? Hello? Well, nope, there he is. He's not electric. He's not electric, is he? He nothing. He's, he's nothing. He's, a nu he's not even got... Oh, because you haven't buffed him yet. Yeah, I haven't got any more action points. So you, if you buff him next turn... All right. Well, did, I did stuff. These guys look so cool. I love the look of them. Don't they look amazing? They look a bit cartoony. I think they look hilarious. They're like, <laughs> they're like, they look like delicious triangles, like forbidden snacks. <laughs> I'm just going to buff you if that's all right. All right. And then maybe I'll see if I can just ricochet a bit of, bit of damage into this guy. Give him a little bit of a chill pill. There you go. Shield failed. Attack of opportunity. They always run away from here. Remember now? I, you remember them constantly running away from this dude and just him killing them every that time? That is so weird that they run from him. They just don't want to fight him. Maybe the AI is like, just doesn't want to fight him. But he, he just hits them so hard when they attack of opportunity. Let's buff him up. There you go, Incarnate. Have some buffs. Enjoy. The great thing about him is that we can just fucking um, zip zap. Just poison dart this dude. Yeah. Well, he's Matthew. Dead. He is dead. Yes, he is. 
This guy is like fucking squishy as hell. He's like almost. No, no, that's the one that's on full life. This, this one one's the one that's really dead. I'm gonna. Um, no. This one. That won't work because he's got armor left. Oh, yeah. Oh, well. That's all right. Just bonk him. That's the thing about this game. You have to make sure they clear yeah. off the arm before you start trying to knock them down and stuff. But once you have cleared off the armor, knocking them down is incredibly powerful. Okay. Because they lose, like... Decaying blocked. Decaying okay. blocked. I guess they can't... They're immune to decay. No, but my incarnate said it. I don't know why. Oh. Well, I think that there's... Um, oh, no! He's poisoned my blood totems. Are they going to die? On yeah. The next attack? Almost certainly. Shit. This fucking yeah, you've got you've applied decaying to your this void salamander. And I think decaying is like one of these combo effects. All right. He's dead. Boink. Oh, my totems. I think it, where what's decaying comes from? I'm playing as just a ranger, flat ranger guys, but I'm interested in. in I think I might just put some points in scoundrel and fire and the bits and bobs, a bit of aerothurge, so I can teleport stuff around and just be. Kind of just have a little bit of flexibility. Because teleportation is is such an amazing spell. Damn it. And also one day I'd like to just cast Chain Lightning even if it doesn't do any damage. Because that's fucking hilarious. Um, Let's put them there. Polymorph is really cool to fly around. Oh, Polymorph sounds pretty cool. Decaying is he all heals deal damage instead. So what, like, makes someone into an undead? Where does where does it come from? Where does the cane come from? Does it come from like um, get hydro for rain spell useful later on? I think I think Duncan's gonna go hydro necro. Yeah, I think so. In yeah, and you can go. I'll go. I'll it. go like a little bit of fire, a little bit of we air. Beat them, Lewis. A bit of scoundrel. <laughs> They're dead. Is it cursed blood? So cursed blood. How do you get cursed blood? How do you curse the blood? Oh, there's something you do to it. Is like a spell you cast on it. I got some pearls here. Oh, this void salamander had a fucking nice necklace, Duncan. Oh yeah. Amulet of the void, plus one finesse, plus one ranged. Oh nice. Which is unbelievably. We powerful. need to get rid of your necklace. and an empty slot. I think the seekers might get rid of your necklace if we can go and find them. Yeah, if I can make friends. The thing is, like normally you have to clear. You, there's like there's normally like at least. Four ways to get the necklace off because mm. you've got four party members you want to clear the necklace yeah. off of, right? At least, if not more. Oops. So, um, wow, that, that necklace seems like incredibly OP because it's not only got plus one finesse and plus one range, but it's got fucking. I'm just lo getting all the loot for my class, really. That is pretty nut nutty. Pretty, pretty, pretty nutty. Uh, have a look. Just run around in poison as if it's like no big One thing deal I, as well. Oh, right, yeah. So I'm necromancy now, but I, I don't have the... i got a bloated corpse. There we go. I need to learn that. Learn skill. Bloated corpse. So what does that do? Does that so I have let to, you raise things off? I think off I have before? to raise a corpse. So let's click it and then click on I guess this we could just one. try doing it's it on... Dead Seeker. <laughs> okay. Mmm. <laughs> it's like a corpse slug. <laughs> and it gets healed from poison too. Bloated corpse. How long does it last? Uh, eight turns worth. Oh, it's staying a while. Blop, 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 blop. Can you just? Yeah, <laughs> seven turns. So it's got quite a long lifespan. It's got a lot of health as well. Should I be the one that initiates these combats blop, blop, in future? Blop, blop, because you blop. can like sort of summon a bunch of shit. If you like find something you think there's going to be combat with, I can initiate the combat. You can summon in all your shit while yeah. I'm chatting. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. Is there more down this beach? I think there might be. Press M. Yeah. It's more of most of it. Well, I hit I hit M and it looked like there was a little bit more down this way. Maybe there's treasure down there. You got you got to look around the corners for treasure. This mm. is this is there's always going to be treasure around the back of places. Oh. Like a little Oh, it's a cave. A hidden cave, Lewis. <gasps> Come to the hidden cave. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, yeah, okay, all right. Yeah, that looks spooky. That looks spooky. There is a guy here, look, That's though. the Seekers. we do that in a bit. All right. So it is, it is this way. Sorry, I just up here, there's a little person, 
and a rope ladder. And I guess we could just is teleport this the, up there. Is this there. the Bracus Rex cave? Be. It's definitely, I know, know this cave that you found is definitely some sort of hidden spooky. I'm going in. Terra cave. Dark cavern. It's called the Vault of Bracchus Rex. Yeah, we, that's it, we found it. Okay. Carefully explore the cavern. We entered a large and potentially dangerous, dangerous cavern. What's For that? us, though, easy. Is this the one with that wizard that's like, keep, you keep fighting that same wizard guy? Oh, you're right. So, yeah, this is a cavern where there is a, a undead guardian of it. He died to protect it and keep it secret. So you could either kill him or convince him that you're allowed in or whatever. Do you remember? Yeah. Vaguely. Can't. Oh, hello. Here he is. There's a box. Reinforced crate. I just teleported that down. Oh, okay. Did you think me teleporting a box down well, I thought some, was the guy? I thought someone was teleporting in. Let <laughs> me get through. <laughs> no, so this is the exit. This this door. So we have ah, to go this way. This is. is the guy. <laughs> Trump doy. <laughs> Did you think me teleporting yeah, the box? Yeah, it looked like it. Hmm. Mm. Um, should we talk to him? Mm. Yeah. Tits. <laughs> Do you even have tits? Uh, I could turn into a woman. I mean, I am a woman, but I could turn into a woman with skin. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what kind of bizarre conversation? <laughs> uh, let's, sorry, I'm just... I don't need vowels, Tom, do I? I want to mention... Oh. I'm just sorting out my inventory while you finish the co chatty conversations. <laughs> you, so tell me what's going on. So he's flirting with my skeleton. He's f okay. He's like a skeletal perv. He is. He's horrible. He's chatting you up. Are you interested? Tell him he has more chance to change if to change his tone, or he's wait. He has one more chance to change his tone. Is skeleton on it. skeleton a, a thing? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna tell him he's got one more chance. Oh dear, oh dear. It looks like he really wants to fight. He's a dead man. He wants to fight. Oh dear. That's bad news. I'm going to pickpocket. Why, why can't I? I thought I just, I just said he's a dead man. And then he d d didn't. No fight started. <laughs> he is dead man. You just told him a fact. A fact of truth, Duncan. A truthful fact. Right. That's it. What? Bonk. <laughs> <laughs> he's not a real one. <laughs> right, try again. Did you just end the conversation with him? Yeah. This is what you're doing. Don't don't do that. We don't need to kill him anyway. We can just move through his place. Oh my god! There we go. <laughs> Took a while, but I got him. The ghostly, ghostly guardian of this thing. Okay, he's got. What is he doing? <laughs> he's got some life, but I mean, honestly, I think we'll probably just be able to. Um, well, maybe I should have elemental arrows to myself. Probably. Let's just buff you as well. Good luck. You're up. Mm. What is your response? Mm. Out of the depths comes a fire fail infusioned. So he fireballed us and then armor frosted himself. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like that was a mistake. He's just given us fire to work with. Yeah. But it did hurt us a little bit. Yeah, it burned a little bit of our magic armor off, but we're not on fire. Okay, that thing shot him for 38 magic damage. This thing's going to hit him for 52 magic damage. Jesus. Exactly. It was all, if it was all physical, I probably would have won already. If I just yeah. not summoned it on the fire. If you, Yeah. <laughs> he's only got 100. Yeah. That's right. You did 113 magic yeah. damage. <laughs> if you summoned it all physical... We need to be better at playing this game. But if I but if I'd just instantly made fire arrows and shot him with fire arrows instead, it would have died. It wasn't exactly he would have died. It wasn't a problem. He killed <laughs> himself. Killed himself. Why do they do that? What possible AI decision is that? Madness. Right. Oh. I've been frozen. An illusion. It was an illusion, Doug. Did we get any um did we get any points for that? So these um, these chests are just illusory crates, and they freeze you when you try and open them. 
if we fake, try and move them. Fake crates. Move them out of the way. <laughs> oh, oh, a, f a fake, an illusory bridge, Dunk. No, it's not an illusory bridge. It's a real bridge that looks invisible. Mm -hmm. All right. So what's this way? There's more crates over here and some bees. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they're bees. I think it's a mushroom. No, above them. Above the mushroom. We've got yeah. a wooden figurine, some orange juice, some stained pants. I think I might just not, not take any of those things. I'll take, <laughs> I'll take the wooden figurine. <laughs> I'm just going to leave this all here. <laughs> I took the wooden figurine because it was worth a bit of cash. God, it's amazing how your veg oh, built up. He's back. <laughs> You're going to go and fucking fight him again. Right. Oh, yeah. Him okay, again. we are going to fight him again. Cool. Um, hey, dude. Good to see you. Boom. I'll buff you. I'll shoot him. Pow. Chilled, blocked by him. Pow. What we need is something that makes blood so I can summon the blood incarnate. Oh, there we go. Look, he's got two of him now. Oh. Good. A great. real one and a sort of illusory one. Well, that's no good. I do. So, I, yeah, I want, I want. I guess I want something that does physical damage. Just get a dude. Physical dude. Yeah, but blood is the best one. I need to... Uh, but there's no blood. I could I use might this bleed. hope. No, I'm freezing. No. It's ice. Okay, that's fine. Let's just make an ice one. I guess. No, I'd make a regular one. Why not? Right in front of him. I'll put it over. You got that one. I'll get this one. Boom. Boom. Power infusion! Why would you leave the freshly pressed orange juice, Duncan? Because I guess undead don't want that. I don't want orange juice. That sounds like it's healthy for you and it probably damages <laughs> undead. Do you know what I mean? Mm. That's what I'm thinking anyway. There we go. Oh, there's another one over there. Oh, there's three of them. I feel like this, this like, the basic incarnate isn't like any worse. <laughs> like it does. I think it's less. It's got like the same amount of health and does the same amount of damage. Uh oh. That's, that's a bit spooky. That's a bit of rain. I wonder if this is going to be tough. Like, this guy's coming coming nah. for you. This ain't going to be tough. All right. You're up again. Is it your go again? Well, it's a new round, so it gets randomized. I guess. Why don't you get to act first on the first turn ever? I don't know. I think you've probably got higher wits than me. Do you reckon it's because I aggroed the conversation? Or you aggroed the conversation, which puts you last in the... I don't know. In the, do you reckon you get a penalty for... Meh. Bonk. I think you just healed him, yeah. Because that was a poison bolt. Is he undead? Yeah. Oh. This one's really dead. Dimensional though. bolt is, is terrible, right? Like, you never know what it's going to do. It might heal them, it might hurt them, and like... But it usually just sort doesn't of... Doesn't even do that much damage. Well, it sort of sets you up, though. I guess it's good for getting a, a pool if you're desperate for one, but honestly, not worth it. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Got this guy. Hey, you're not bad XP. Okay. He's going to have to run all the way over. I, <laughs> I decided I was going to teleport over because it's better to like focus ourselves on this yeah. side. Bonk! Okay, well, he's fucking out of the fight now. Smash! Oh, that's ludicrous damage. Just more totems. Yeah. More totems, buffing. totems. Like a wow shaman. Dead. <laughs> we got our little squirrel boy. Yeah, he's around. always around. It's weird how he just keeps coming, hanging around with us, even into like... A yeah, and then he, he hates day. us as well. We try and talk to him. He's just like, oh, you're, you're disgusting. I'm like, why are you following me then? Jeez. <laughs> oh my god, look at that damage. Wow. Bloody hell, you nearly killed him. You did kill him. <laughs> I know. Was that you that finished him <laughs> off? Was or was the totem. it Totem? <laughs> the Totem does the same damage as me, honestly. Uh, look, there's a chest here. 
you want to te teleport it? No, no, I don't. Ah, it's not real! Son of a bitch! I'll get you! Tromp doy. Get a, tro a trap chest. Tromp doy. Bloody tromp doy. I'm going to bonk him with a... Poor, poor fool. I'm, st I'm still trusting that this chest. So these are his, like, um... His, like, traps, I guess, that he set up. Okay. I got, I got it. <laughs> it's ours now, Lewis. <laughs> it's empty, but it's ours. So there's an invisible wall here, Duncan, by the way. Oh. Um, there's this, we haven't been this way yet, have we? Yeah, but this is the way through. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. And this leads to a chest, I think. Oh, careful. And a trap. trap. There are bombs there. Be careful, don't step on those. Oh, jeez. <laughs> a well-worn chest, a wand of nature, a fortified scroll, and Careful. twenty-eight gold. So what's the wand of nature? Is that any good? I think no, it's not. It's not worthless. It's a crappy fire damage wand. But I mean, these things are actually not terrible if you have two of them. I got. Yeah. You could duel with wads, so you could go eight to nine, and then eight to nine. That's yeah. a lot of damage, and it scales with intelligence. I guess I should be using magic. I just uh, I I feel like physical damage is the way to go with us because you do too much. I feel like there's the so much point in me looks chipping dangerous. off magic armor. Watch out for those two mines. Oh. <laughs> oh no, I nearly lost all my armor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is back. Oh, some bees over here on the skeleton. Oh, is this a way down? Oh my god, what's this big ice crystal? There's a root down here. Oh yeah, it's a giganto ice crystal. There's some bees here and a well-worn chest in the corner. Fine. I'm just going to go check out this. It's well-worn. What'd you a get? A poisoned arrow here. Worthless. Worthless shit. Nothing, Nothing else is down just here. Just crap, Duncan. Just bollocks. Um, just nothing mm. of value. Oh, look. Oh. There's... Oh, this is the freaking puzzle that is, like, really hard. <laughs> Do you remember the result? Do you remember how to do this? Because I do not. The puzzle. Mysterious room. Uh, talk to it. What do you uh, listen in? Let's have a look. Okay, Statue of Illusions. Yes, I'd like to move forward. A Bracus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. Some even call him a cur. A cur is, uh, ah, uh, so so this this applies to B R A C C U S, what? right? So Bracus is a code, right? So it's the, the C. Oh. Are, that's why he says very, very, because the very is the C. So a cur is a very awful. Oh, uh, I rotten. see. No. Scourge, devil, misery, blight, hex. Yep. Cure, cure is a hex, a misery, a blight, a curse. Oh, yeah. There we go. We did it. Well done, Lewis. Bye. That was very straightforward, wasn't it? Well, I didn't remember how it worked. <laughs> I remember that taking me e forever. It's just a little bit of, like, classic verbal reasoning riddle. I think I, I, I literally, I think I just reloaded until I got it right. Got the right one. Okay. <laughs> that is the way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a crafting. I understand it now, though. I, 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 I never got it before, but I get it now. I'm yoinking all these paintings off the wall, by the way, and taking them with. Um, the rat tells you what to do, Duncan, if he talks with it. The oh. rat? Oh, right. Oh, really? I'm going to talk to Pet the little pal. rat. Hello, little sliver. It's called Sliver. Anything with caps on is always like a little bit of a dead giveaway. Hello! A what? <laughs> Accused a rat of being an illusion. Oh. Takes one to no one. <laughs> <laughs> and these doors. It's a riddle, in it? A conundrum. A what's it if you have to solve? <laughs> All right, thanks, little rat. What a, what a friendly fellow. <laughs> Pet pal is just the best. Friendly fellow. What about this mysterious door? 
Uh, did you open the treasure chests in here? No? Do you want to, do you want to, do you want to open them? This door leads to nowhere. <laughs> what? I'll let you do the honours of the treasure chest. You can do the one on the right. Oh, no, you do both. I've got a dagger and a mushroom and some gold. And I exploded. But I got new recipes. What are they? they? I don't know. I think I read a crafting Bible. Uh, G is crafting <laughs> recipes. It's H. Ooh. Oh my god. Shocking touch scroll. Okay, we need any air essence and some flour and some paper. Favorable wind scroll. Ooh. Panties and what? air essence. Panties? I'm not even joking. You need panties to make a favorable, favorable wind, wind scroll. <laughs> Where the fuck do you get panties from? <laughs> <laughs> That's a serious pickpocketing. <laughs> <laughs> That's so <like> expert level. <laughs> oh my god. Any gold plus air essence makes a blinding <laughs> radiance scroll. Feels quite expensive. Found another illusional bridge. Panties. <laughs> I mean, I understand. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I get the joke, but. Oh, this is quite a nasty ambush, this one. Helps. Trump thought it's back. Used chameleon cloak. I think that makes you invisible. Invincible? Invisible. <laughs> um, I mean, we have Play Dead, which feels like the most broken ability. Yeah, it really does. It's like Especially when you have it on both your characters. Might just, I might go poison then. I think if you kill the real Trump Doy, if you know which one's uh. real. Look at that. I, I healed him. If you kill the real one, it, all the others good. die, I think. Oh, so I've, I've poisoned them all, and now they're healing. <laughs> it's, it's a good start. <laughs> Why don't you just summon your incarnate? You know the standard build. Standard incarnate. Come on, then. Hmm. And power infusion. I think this is like a little game. Trumpler wants to play games, right? So yeah, play game. I think the invisible one is the real one. Oh yeah, that makes sense, Chinch. We'll just kill them all. We get XP. Uh, I don't think you do. I want to raise one of his bodies. I don't think he has a body. Fortify. Good job. Splat. If you didn't summon him close enough, apparently. <laughs> Annoying. Easy to do. Wow, he's got loads of dudes, doesn't he? Is he going to lob some stuff at you? No, he's just fortifying. So which one's the real one? The one over there? Yeah, I think I need to head over there then. Kill them all. Shields up. We can get them all, don't worry. This is not going to be a problem. I'm going to retreat over here. Ooh. Where is this guy? How do, how do I find him? Hmm. Don't know. I guess I'll just shoot this guy nearby. Boink. Use rain, apparently. We haven't got rain yet. I've got a rain scroll. There he is. This is the real one. Do we not get XP for the other ones, though? <sighs> XP, Duncan. I mean, come on. Yeah, we need to level up. This guy, watch, kill him. You don't. I wouldn't think you would. I'm sure we did before on the last one, but maybe these aren't a loop. These are different to the last fight. No, I can't buff you. Right, if you if you make sure this guy gets shot the one next to me with some physical damage. You might have to back out, actually, because you're getting fucking peppered. I'm all right. Come around here. Oh. Drop a totem on this, uh, um, on this dude next to me. Uh, I'll just put it here or shoot him. Oh, that's true. You can't actually control who it shoots either, can you, mm. I guess? It might just shoot the wrong guy. You can't target them. Do you get a skill eventually that lets you target them? Do you, get, do you ever get I don't know. control your totems? I have no idea. That might be fun. Oh. Yeah. Boop. Um, Boop. Mahan says, when you guys started playing this, I also started playing again. I wanted to try out a skeleton level pro through. I used to have about 67 <coughs> hours in the game. Now I have 125 hours in the game. Wow. Oh, my God. Well, that's, that's, so that's how long it takes to finish the game. Is it 65 hours? Move here. And then so how long is that? How many streams is that? 
So we've done, what, three streams on this now? Yeah. So is this our fourth or is this our third? This must be our fourth. So we're, we're nine hours in. Well, 60, I guess 65 divided by nine is like Cancel. seven. No, we're canceling. So, there we go. Bonk. No. So it's divided by, I need to divide it by three. Sorry, 65 divided by it, three. Doing this single player, it took me about 12 hours to get off the island. Really? Mm. But then I, did, I didn't rush through it like this. We're not really rushing through it. Bam. Ah, oh, they did all die, so we got the XP. Cool. I killed the real one. Holy shit, the loot, Duncan. Is it good? Can I just explain to you how much loot we had? Wow. So we got three rings. This guy had fucking, f f like, three rings on his hands. <laughs> he had the Band of Brachus, which obviously is the cursed thing, but if you wear the whole set... Oh, yeah. Um, you can clear it. Or there's a way to, like, clear it off, I think. I don't know how. You've got to have the whole set. Yeah. Uh, we got his hatchet, which is a fucking one-handed axe. Worth that a lot. can, like, axe people to a question. Gold. Lots of gold. A magical spear. Magical two spear. more unidentified rings, oh. which you're going to have to identify. A sword, sword tooth, tooth knife, knife. Which I think means daggers. Yeah, requires a dagger. And a small frost rune. Cool. Yoink. I'll uh, identify those things for you if you want. So, yeah, Send don't wear that ring. So I think if you wear the ring, it gets stuck on you. No, it doesn't. I got, I got the boots. I'll send you all this stuff. I, I had. The, did I sell the boots? Oh, I might, I might have sold them. Oh, no, no, it's a tyrant set. Wait. No, it's not. Where's the... Hmm. Anyway, I'll send you I'll send tyrant you this set stuff. different? So I can't identify any of this. I don't remember. Identify... The band of brackets is already identified. A magical spear. The ring is not part of the set. Okay. A kissed ring. Air wow. resistance and plus one summoning. Man, I'll, I'll wear that, I guess. And a joyous ring. Constitution and air research. Actually, if I wear that, that means I can use my blood rain. You can get the air research point from got the air research, yeah. item. From the item. Where is my blood rain? Did I actually buy it? I have lost the book. I don't know if you ever did buy it, you know. I thought I had it. Oh, here it is. Yeah. Learn skill. Could not learn raining blood. The skill book requirements are not met. I don't think you get the... Oh, it's Aerotherge, not Hydro... Oh, it's uh, the wrong thing. The wrong not Hydrosophist. Hydrosophist. Like, uh, uh, you can use this ring, then. I'll give you Aerotherge. I'm not... Oh, I guess I'm... Yeah, right. <laughs> I have cheesed so many faces. <laughs> yeah. So many faces. <laughs> <laughs> Could you get this guy's face as well? He's over here. What does set cursed mean then? I guess he doesn't have a... F so, I, so, I could, so I wear this Brachus ring. The ring just got tighter. Oh. A lot tighter. I don't think you can take it off now. Something isn't right. Yeah, you can. Oh. The ring's gone, but not the oh, I'm still cursed. <laughs> What's the curse do? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. uh, you have got... Holy shit, you're pretty badly cursed. Um, <laughs> no! Minus thirty percent dodging, ten percent accuracy, and fifteen percent all resistances. <laughs> wow, that's bad. You got fucked up. I uncurse myself. Uh, I think you need to cast bless on yourself, which needs a source point. I what? Think. What? The hell? Yeah. I think, I think there's seekers that can cast it. On. I don't think you can get blur, blessed, blessed. Blurst. I don't think you can get blessed until later in the game when you have a source point to spend. I think you have to like bless on various things. Like I think once you finish the first chapter, question mark, you can do it, question mark. And then you can bless things, like you can bless like a divine lever. There's a bit in the game where we go to, to go to our God's temple, whatever, and we become like the chosen one. Anyway, this is the treasure room up here. Do you remember? Because I think that's it. I think we're done now. And there's a load of fucking treasure in this room. Mm. Are you just terrified about your curse? No, I did warn you about putting on I the ring to which see says it. it's cursed. Is it worse if I'm wearing it or not? No, it's the same if you're wearing same it. You've curse. got the curse now. Right, so I've got a nice ring, though. That's good. You, yeah. I mean, it's a nice ring, but I think you are cursed. <laughs> I, I'm, I, I'm, I remember there being a, a bless somewhere. Like, it, it wasn't hard to get one. I've, yeah. I've probably brought this before. It's not a thing I do. I think it's a... <laughs> I think you need a source point. 
Yeah, cursed is not. But a I think great you, someone does it on you or something. So this. Oh is the my God, the treasure! So press Alt, and you'll see. Ba, 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 ba. So there's Trump soldier. Boy's soldier, Gratiana's soldier. So these are two, and there's four ah, soldiers. There's a tyrant yeah. armor here. That is part of the tyrant set. Yeah. Yeah. So I've got two pieces of it now. Uh, there's a super nice there's jet. A, oh, the purging wand. Purging wand is is useful for getting rid of. So you want to keep that? Yeah, I think Very that's useful for some. I remember there being a fight near the end where you could like purge things away or something. I don't remember. Supernova, <laughs> pyrokinetic two. Hey, that sounds like something you should get. Explode, creating fire surfaces and dealing fire damage. Yeah, I mean, I guess I could start the fight by going supernova. But is that a scroll or a skill book? It's a skill book. Go and grab that. Fine. We've got all these soldiers to check out as well. Do you want to collect all those? Do we just keep them for now until we need new... Oh, hello. You made it all this way. You made it all this way. Yes, I did. Well, he had to defend. I'm sorry. I, think. I think his his job was like he had to fight you. His curse. Black Bloody Brackers, Brackers bound me to protect his vault. He has my soul there. As long as the jar stays unbroken, I can never truly die. Should we break his soul jar? Um. Well, I mean, do you think he's like? Did you did you think he was awful? It's up to you. You know, you have to make a decision, really. I think we should troll him like he trolled us. <laughs> this was the source king's <laughs> way. Befriend you, then destroy you. Oh dear, poor guy. His um, well, what do you want to do? It's no excuse. He was he was a charismatic man, old Brachus Rex. <laughs> You're very torn about this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he was really that difficult. Oh, <laughs> you miss. I'm guy. sorry. Oh, I'll take it though. Maybe I'll break it later when I feel a bit more kind. Oh. Oh, he's crying in there. Jesus, that's sad. So poor old, um, poor old Brachus Rex. A new face. He was a jester. Not Brachus, poor Brachus, but poor old uh, Trump Doy. And a my gold and deadly silence. Should we absorb his soul? <laughs> well, you've already got a source point. You don't need that. I'm just going to keep it then. All right. But I feel like letting him out later. I can always do that. <laughs> you know, if I start feeling a bit more generous. Who's this guy? Decadent lech. It's a decadent lech. All right, all right, fine. Put that in my backpack as well. I'm going to keep them all, Lewis. Just in case. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. We don't know what we're doing. Oh. There's a dwarf. A beautiful woman. The dwarf mutters a word. And the undead lurch towards the intruder, but are cut down, cut down like wheat. I suppose we are just like undead. Yeah, we're playing, like, you know, kind of assholes. Duncan, the new source king. Not that one. You're just collecting up fucking more. <laughs> I've got some. I just want to have the option. I've got some on. boots for you to identify here. Oh, yeah. By the way, I'll send those over. Um, the lizard dude. The human apes turn away. He promises, power. He promises power for a price. He picks off your golden scales one oh. by one. You try to fight, try to reclaim what's yours, but the woman takes you back. He promised he'd take me home. You cry. You are home. You are home. She seals that your hand drops away from the soul jar. Have you read all of these crafting bibles and stuff you've got? You hear a small, stern voice. Yeah, it looks like it. All right. I'm <laughs> just collecting the soul charts. <laughs> yeah. Come on, I got Rask's soul, Gwick's soul, Trompdoy's soul, and Gratina's soul. There's yeah. another one as well. Oh, is there? <gasps> I've missed someone's soul. <laughs> That's close. 
I got. Press I'm just collecting souls and faces. <laughs> yes. One day I will combine them to make new people. <laughs> Jesus Christ! That's terrifying. <laughs> So there are the, yeah, these other people are other servants of him, mm. I guess, and so it's possible some some of them might want their soul back. Maybe, but they're not having it, Lewis. I got it now. It's mine. <laughs> A person made entirely of faces. We <laughs> <laughs> got a donation list. So Linda, is he the um, is he the squirrel boy? Sir Laura. Oh, it's a different guy. Uh, <laughs> Hey, Lulu and Doug, I just wanted to pop in and say hi. I haven't been watching too many streams lately because of work-related stuff. That's okay, dude. I mean, we literally just sit around here and play games all day. I mean, you're not, you're not missing out. Um, it's, it's fairly, it's fairly straightforward. Oh, God. Having a chat to a view. We're better off without vile necromancers like that. We're better off without vile necromancers They may have been like a necromancer. They do not feel evil, no. What could be more vile than the memories of a necromancer? So this is... Um, I'm playing someone who's bitter that, that they've been raised as undead. I mean, you're, <laughs> you're, got, you're learning how to lear, raise bloated corpses. Yeah, as a revenge for what happened to me. <laughs> what, uh, what are these boots, then, that you want me to identify? Yeah, just some treasure. Ah, oh, these purple ones. Nice. I'm just nicking stuff off the walls. Uh, prowlers. You get battering ram skill, plus 10 earth resistance, and plus 12 HP. They're pretty cool. I might wear them. Unless you want them. Do you want battering ram? Uh, doesn't feel like something you need, really. I'm all right. <laughs> Although, I, yeah, I do have decent boots. I've got laced scale boots already. Give me... Oh, no, that's... Yeah, I've got boots that are good. Yeah, my boots are fine. I'm good. We could sell them. Do you want some stuff like some of these things that I've got, like static cloud arrows, poison arrows? Yeah, chuck me any arrows that you've got going. All right. I'll probably make more use of them than you will, I think. Um, although I don't know, it sort of depends, doesn't it? Because do you want some grenades? Um. Okay. Oh, this is good bleeding. Yeah, cool. All right. It's nice to have a poison arrowhead because that can heal you on, mm. a, on a dime. Seven poison arrowheads I've got now. Nice. Oh, there's another knock, how, knock, knock down arrowhead. Sweet. So I guess we can leave now through this door. Do, 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 do. I, might I might equip a, a star. Or oh, the purging wand. I think it would be fun. Yoink. All right, we're out. We're free. That was a bit of a that was a bit of an adventure. We did that fairly cleanly. Didn't we? I'm still cursed, Lewis. You will be cursed until we can find a way to bless you. Is there a, anything in here that might help me out? Um What's this? I'm going to say is this probably not. No. You know, you haven't searched all this yet, have you? Oh, Madman's Enclave. The deity's head and hands are missing, severed as if by a sword. Oh, right. Sorry. No, I d haven't expl explored oh, the man's explore cavern. I, something happened to me. Champion of the gods. I prayed at an altar and found myself in the Hall of Echoes. I'm in the Hall of Echoes? What the shit is this? Oh, yes, shit. This is the fucking... This is the god place. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll get blessed by a god. Yeah, this, is, this maybe is it. Yeah. I imagine they would put, you know, a way to get your as you take curse it, off in the, in the same dungeon. That's yeah, this is where you can talk to your god. What is this place? Question mark. Hello, I'm Amanda. Amadia. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're down there. You walk towards the figure on the dais. You see and now I think uh, it might, it might her hand benefit me to take, she take the curse hand, ring off before I get blessed. <laughs> what, you think the curse is just because... No, I think you only get recursed if you re-put it on. Okay. <laughs> Why, is she going to bless you? I don't know. I think maybe. Um, it's been so long! <laughs> 
Your arms rest on, but as you stand, your left stands. I love my mum. Stands the goddess, ever the gent. Please beg of me, creeps ever closer. My sure, child. okay. I mean, even here, even in the hall of echoes. I cannot be sure. I'm not sure so who this is. My mother was a lizard. Oh, it's a Madia. It's uh, she's the mother of magic. So I think she's like. This is a lot of story, and this is like this is like pretty complicated stuff. I didn't really ever really understand your in your arms. This any of this. So this is like the a mother godmother, like an actual godmother. Your hands start to sink through her, and the vision of your mother. I'm not reading any of that smoke crap. I, I seem to remember I tried to read this before. And I found it incredibly boring. <laughs> so I was like, ah, it was just the just the vision. Uh, I'm gonna bow before my goddess. Boop. We're not on. We're not on like easy, easy mode. We're on um, normal mode, classic mode. But it's like the void creeps ever closer, my child. Even here in the hall of echoes. Mm. Yeah. I mean, I suggest you just spam one through it because it's all oh, it's, it's it does someone in chat want to give us like a a, a kind of two sentence overview of this the story because it's kind of it's kind of hard to <laughs> it's kind of hard to, to smash through does Lewis know that as an archer he also needs to go to warfare skill to get damage yeah, you do. I, I did know that but I feel like it feels gamey to do that, you know? She's she's making me her champion. You have been lost for so long. That's right, that's why she gives you the bless you spell. Ah, oh, getting blessed. You may have noticed I have tried to help you on your journey. I just got I given this is only the beginning. a thing by the More squirrel. What? Yeah, the squirrel just gave me shit. Thing. I can talk to him. I spoke to him and he gave me something. What? I gathered that you travel with a pack of others. He said erratic wisp spell book. But I can't see it. And it's not appearing in my inventory. Ooh. I must be the one that reached... Oh, I'm not going to talk to her about that, Louis. So apparently you're not allowed to uh, get to the end. <sighs> all right, all right, I'm done. Thank God. Still cursed. <laughs> but you have the bless spell. Yeah, so I do. Take the ring off. Maybe we have to craft the... Erratic Wisp spell book. Okay, so we need any Era Third skill book and any Huntsman skill book to oh, make the Erratic Wisp. All right, I'll bear that in mind. Rain scrolls, fish plus water essence plus sheet of paper. Resurrection scrolls, life essence plus water essence plus sheet of paper. Okay. Less target surface or character. Less. Let me go. You're cursed. I'm cured. He's c cured. Yeah. Do you have your that ring? Is that ring still like? Well, no, I took it off. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm gonna go and sell it to someone and back. say, "Oh, nothing wrong with this ring. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Perfectly good um, ring." So basically, I think that bless used up your source point. It did, but I've got all these all these soul jars that I can replace it with if I need to. That's true. You can drink people's souls. Starting okay. with. Uh, Trump toy. Trump toy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to yet. Doesn't that sort of release him? I no. Guess, I guess, how does that work then? What does I that mean? Just draining his soul. Worker drones said, uh, identify those boots. I think you did that already. Yeah. Were they, they, were, were they worth it? You don't they know. were good, yeah. Murphington resub, thank you. Downsyman donated. He says, Merry Festage. Merry Lewis Festage. And Dunk. From the land of the long white cloud, aka New Zealand. Oh. And we were in New Zealand this time last year, weren't we? We were. I loved it. And I want to go back. It was super nice. Super, super nice. We had a lovely time. It was very much, very familiar. It was very comfortable. It was mm. like just an English summer, wasn't it? It was like England, but better in every way. Yeah. <laughs> just less people, more yeah. countryside, more epic like landscapes, beaches. I don't know, just like... 
England better upgraded. I think. Kiwi birds. Uh, Kiwi birds. One of the soul jars is. I think all the soul jars. Have you, have you pulled the oh. sleever yet, Lewis? Yeah, that opened the. Um, yeah. Opened that door. That one. This one. Yeah. Okay, we did it. We did Bracker's Rakes' cavern without any any problems. I do feel like this might be too easy. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm like, we're just storming through. I guess we're not actually off the island yet. We'll probably get harder. We are smashing every combat that yeah. goes away, like, really badly. Maybe we need to take Lone Wolf off. <laughs> no, no way. Think of all the points that we'll lose. Plus, we'll have to have two other guys then. That would be a nightmare. Yeah, it would be a nightmare to control. How do we make it harder? Can we change the difficulty up to tactician? Maybe we should have kept the curse. <laughs> Each of us could have kept the curse. We could play it cursed. <laughs> I don't think there's a way to change the difficulty up. I think we should just go. Th I mean, it's fun. It's not like we're not having fun. We're just getting the story. We're, we're not playing, playing on easy mode. No. I mean, the thing is that there is like a, there's like a journalist mode, which is like just the story. And oh, all really? the fights are like really easy. But journalist mode. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> I think, yeah, sorry, we want to go this way, Duncan. Cause this Apparently is it gets harder, so we shouldn't worry. All right. As long as, as long as the chat thinks it's going to get harder. There's a squirrel over here I want to chat to. You can t you can difficulty will get harder. There is a mod for difficulty. Mm. Hello? Where's the squiggle? How do we... Ah. Hello. Goodness, big, big fire boom. Lightning crash. Chirp excitedly. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A hyperactive squirrel saw a thunderstorm. Boo-hoo. <laughs> What do you mean to a squirrel? Continues for? the lively story. One moment, son. One moment, son. Next, I feel dark with beside me. That noise, so much noise. Clank, moan, clink, groan. Clank, I'm a squirrel. I'm not a stupid squirrel. Pet pals the best. <laughs> People have like interesting shit. Animals have the the most interesting. They do. I saw the shiny. <gasps> He's telling us where some treasure is. Whoa. Mm. Okay. Shinies. Shinies. Darkness left. Where? Salamanders. Salamanders are dead. Yay! Okay. Yay! I hope you find He's saying there's treasure. He said there's treasure somewhere where the salamanders were. It's in the sand. Okay. We've checked over here. This is where the, the cave was. Hmm. Wonder if it's like here? Over here, maybe. Near a stump? Look for a stump. There are some traps underneath the Ah, here you go. Look, underneath there's a pile. Ah. Surrounded by traps. Underneath this boat. I'll go and dig it for you. Here you go. This but there are explosive mines. Oh. Oh my gosh. So Laura just ignited like Are you okay? One yeah, of the traps. He's got a lot of health. He won't die. A trap. Better give it a wide berth. Just dig this treasure. Here you go. Um. <laughs> so Laura just ran Hey, over. look. Identified one-handed mace. Uh, why am I just never getting any like cool ones or staffs? Just maces. That mace looks like a snake. It does it cool. Let's have a look. Ooh. Big Bertha. Big Bertha. <laughs> 7% lifesteal, set poisoned. Okay. It's, it's just physical, though. It's all physical. There you go. That's still some like treasure. Mellow. See, that squirrel, that pet pal has just paid for itself. Totally. That, with that cash. Cash. <laughs> Is the cat still with him? I think so. No, the cat died. Dark Zucker needs to say, Lewis, bit off topic. Is there any plans for you and Lydia to play um, Sexy Brutal? Yeah, that was on our. That was actually the one that Lydia wanted to, to play with me she was like let's play this murder mystery type game so this is so friday mornings are normally me and lydia but she's not very well so send her a, send her your love on twitter or wherever she's probably bored out of her mind <laughs> so there's a woman up here on this cliff face on this cliff face. oh right yeah well, I get bahara there you are. so this is how you get to the seekers and she says stand back and keep your hands off your weapons convince me you're no magister. So you can click on her to listen into this conversation. Oh. As always, Duncan. That's the way it works. Oh, um, oh. There's treasure I missed. Okay, you handle that. Anyway, I'm telling her that I'm not a magister. 
and she's like, oh, um, welcome up to the, to the sanctuary, sanctuary of Amadia. So this is a town, I think. Oh, this is the Seeker's town? Yeah. The Sanctuary of Amadia. So yeah, there's oh, a bunch shit, of Lewis. guys here. There's a freaking portal over here. Yeah, I think that's like a Bracus Rex thingy. I can come over to you if you want. I can do the town in a bit. Although I have got so much loot I need to sell. <laughs> oh, really? My inventory is like... Oh, this is that Oh, this is that big maze thing. Okay, we'll, we'll ignore that for now. We'll come and do that later. Let's, go to, let's go to town. Full of shit. I'm coming. I just, I'm just so I antsy about the massively overfilled inventory of crap that I've got. Um, I feel like we don't need to... I feel like the, the original town, like, they sold us most of the skill books already. Um, yeah. I mean, we... we a young man in oversized yeah. armor takes every approach. The maze is easy if you have tactical retreat. You get teleport as well. Yeah. That'll help. A sorcerer, a seeker, okay. Hello, town. Signs of resistance. I'm pretty sure we've seen them. Exeter. Level 7 trader. So, what's a god woken? We are god woken. A sorcerer's. Mm, something special. That's got a special sorcerer. Steal all the skill books. Oh my god. What does this guy sell? He sells watermelons and meat. Well, yes, I think that's have us cornered. How much gold has he got? They 24. Useless. Weapons called shriekers. Bye. If we try to go he looks injured. Should I heal him? I don't have to heal anymore. Took the ring off. But he hasn't risen yet. It hasn't succeeded mm. his father. If he's so who, what is... God woke to humans that have been infused with some of the gods' powers. Right. Sorcerers chosen by gods. So Verdas was one of them. He was the guy in the prison who they killed. And so the Seekers were going to try and rescue him. They were sorcerers. Um, but after whatever perversions the Magister subjected... Mm. After we retreated here, our leader, Sagarath, set out looking for some ancient weapons... That I remember this so... The Seekers then are led by this guy called Sir Gareth, right? Yeah. Who's gone off looking for weapons. Now, we have to go and rescue him because he's cornered by some bad stuff at some point in the map. He hasn't returned. Um, so we need to Sir see Gareth if we can come you'll, you'll, his shoulder, rescue Sir you. Gareth. Okay. Please ask. Whatever. Well, before right. there's yeah. a Yeah, and who's, who's Alexander? So he is, is he the leader of the bad guys? Alexander is the, yeah, like the head of, head of the church thing, Without that big picture of him. Is in the... will never rise. Take away C.K. Denny says, The gods gave some of their power to the Godwoken in order for them to ascend, become the divine, and hold back the void. Okay. So, gods Ooh. give power to Godwoken. Who's, who's Alexander? Is he bad or good? I think he's bad, right? Is he like? Bad. I thought I thought because there were like pictures of him. They, like, it was, is it, isn't he like the leader of the? Isn't he some sort of? He's the son of Lucia, who was the previous divine. So what? There's one guy who's the divine. Yeah. And are you supposed to be the new divine? Oh, Alexander is the current divine. Yeah, but he's right. a bad guy. So Lucian, he was a good divine. His son is Alexander. Sending He's the leader of the Magisters. Books. Hmm. He's not the divine. Okay. He thinks he wants to be. God. He wants to figure out a way to be divine. Yeah. Sir right. Gareth, he's the finest seeker I know. I'm not none. All right. So we know we know he's somewhere, and we know that if they if they use like. I think we need to use purging wands on those seekers, don't we, or whatever. Um, I'm, uh, there's there's lots of different things you can use purging wands on, and we got to figure out what we want to each save the charges for. So we're Godwoken, Amadi, or we we both like each of us are independently Godwoken. Yeah, <laughs> it's a bit weird. Lucian was a player character in Divine Divinity. What? Correct? Maybe question mark? Yeah, you could use them on the purging wands. You can use them on shriekers. Yeah. Can we kill Shriekers on our own, though, because we're overpowered? No. They, like, one-shot you if you ah. go up to them, remember? Oh, yeah. No. They have, like, horrible superpowers. Um, I've learned uh, some... Hi 
Hydro Majiggies. I'm not supposed to trust other god Pokemon. I'm not supposed to. That's what your god warned us. Yeah. Well, fuck it. Um, yeah, I was also told not that you, you wouldn't be able to make it to the end, so. Bad cool. Luck. Bad luck on that one. Bad luck. Right. Staff of the Matrix. What are these scrolls I've got? Led by Lucian's son, Alexander, the dominant magister of the Divine Order. They, so that's what they started with, right? Okay. Cool. I'm vaguely following it, guys. I'm vaguely following it. <laughs> I'm doing my best, all right? I'm, I'm, I know I'm skipping story, but I kind of just want to get broad strokes. Who are you? Level five jewels. Nope. How much can I offer all my wares? Oh my god, I can offer 1,000. So I've given you two fire skill books already. Yeah. So you don't have to buy these. Gonna s I've already got peace of mind. I don't need that as well. You do. You've got, we've got two supernova skills. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So one of this. Do I want to learn some polymorph? Fuck it. I could just learn some of these skills and give them a go. What's the one that's good apparently? Spread your wings. Allow you to fly. You already know this skill. What? Hmm? I guess I must have already learned it when I... I must have got it from eating someone who knew it. Oh. Yeah. Strange. Curb and evening cloak. Does anyone do summoning skills around here? Ah, you do. Much the bolt, rallying cry. It's a bit useless. Elemental totem, supercharger skill book. Target, oh right, yeah, that doesn't sound very good, honestly. Fast infusion, power infusion, conjuring, I don't know, all those. Necromancer, though, I can learn something. Chloroform, hey. touch, death wish, blood sucker, bloated corpse, shackles of pain. There, I've got enough skills for now, I think. I'm just going to buy some skill books, I think. Yeah. Might as well. I've got so many wares to offer that I feel like I've got so mm. much cash. That I'm not going to cheese it. I'm not going to just steal these guys' skill books. But I'm going to just play around with some of these skills, I think. Because I haven't really been playing around too much with skills. Um, all right. We're going we're gonna to... And I also just wanted to learn some, some new stuff. So let's put some points in. Because I haven't actually put any points into... Polymorph. Scoundrel. <laughs> Oh, I'm just sell a lot of this stuff. Putting a point in Polymorph doesn't seem to give me an additional one from Lone Wolf. Oh. Feels a bit That's strange. strange. Maybe you only get a certain amount from Lone Wolf. What? That's weird, isn't it? The birds are asleep. Yeah. Hmm. Not a skill point, says. It's not. I was getting two from. She normally mine, gets though. bonus. Yeah, from, from lone, lone wolf, wolf plus two. But this apparently being a lone wolf polymorph doesn't give you additional skill points. Would that be broken? One point in polymorph. It's because every point in polymorph is one tribute point. Oh, I see. So it would be like really broken. Oh. Uh, I wondered why that was the case. But I thought it might just give you the points in Polymorph, but without the free. No. Nah. Oh, I see, because... Well, it's just not as good, is it? It's just not as good. Anyway, I'll play, I'll play around. Um, let's put a bit in memory. Bit in... Selling some random stuff. 36, 25. It feels like we've got... We're pretty flush with cash, mostly. We haven't needed to, like, do too much. Do I get a point in Lucky Charm for extra cash? Bartering. Me. Me. Wait, did you level up again? Or have you just been saving the point? I just haven't bothered to put anything in. Oh. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'll put it in Lucky Charm. Fuck it. Who cares? Fucking sue me. Fucking sue me. I'm going to keep these daggers and your arrowheads with. All you can see of her eyes are two dark uh, holes in an ornate mask. Might as well. Please come back. Teleportation. That does require area. There's two. I will need that eventually. 
Yeah, if you can get that skill, then I can have the gloves, and then we'll be both have it. I don't know what else is really that useful. Question mark. I'll buy a teleportation just for the future reference. Cool. Acceptable. I sold some bits. Uh, do you want um, ah, these limbs that I found? This is Gratiana. We have her soul. I think if we give her her <laughs> soul jar back, she will get my collar off. Okay. I've um, sent you some bits of flesh, by the way, that you can munch away at. Gratiana, show her, her, her the jar with her name she on it and ask her about it. All right. Where, where is she? Have you, can, you, can you do it without... Oh, okay. You You're very keen to get your soul you drop back. Of course she is. I need it. Please give it to me. She really wants it back. Give it to her. Hand she it. reaches greedily for the jar. You see a green glowing. Oh my god, she's actually I'm sucking her own soul I off. Feel I feel I, I, wet. I suppose Goodness. But more than she was the concubine of Rackus Rex. I discovered his yeah. power to feed on the soul. She was his others. partner. And oh my god. No. I made she was the person who made the magic Not purging I. ones. Oh, no. She just learned These about them. Right. Anyway, so basically Brachus became powerful by way. sucking source out of his enemies. Mm. Yes. Much like he what you're doing by drinking everyone's soul jars. Anyway. Brahmadia, forgive me. I gave him more and more. So she, she, she gave him like the source of hundreds of villages. Until I Jeez, she was a pretty evil person. I, I think so. Should have smashed her jar. Now <laughs> no, not smashed it. The other one. Stop it. Hidden it? I don't know. She pauses for you found your way. Well done. Job done. She okay. You Thank you. Thank Goodbye. You Where's she, she didn't take the collar off of us. Hello again. I thought she might have done. <laughs> what brings you here? Well, it's wasted a soul jar. Shit. Wasted a good, perfectly good soul jar by giving someone evil soul back. You could just talk to the lady dwarf. You pickpocket her soul. Right. No, the lady dwarf is the one that I got my collar off with. I've done that one. I know, there's another dwarf here, isn't there? Oh. I'm pretty sure that someone here. But I might, might have to rescue what's his face. Is this her? No. You need to save Gareth oh, first, then you get your collar off. If you're looking for healing, sorcerer. Let's go and save Gareth. Well, All right, fine. After a quick break. <laughs> um, we'll be back in five minutes. I've got a shit ton of new spells to fuck around yeah. with. Oh, God. All right. See you I'll five. do that in five. BRB.
Welcome Hello, back. Everyone. Welcome back. Welcome Thanks back. Thanks for joining us this morning in Divinity mm, 2. Mm, mm. Original Sin 2. Original Sin 2. I, I just equipped the ring, which gives me restoration. I'm going to use it on some of these dudes. Right. Yeah, I think you can do that. Yeah, you can heal up some of these local fellas with a bit of healing. Yeah. You brought him back from the brink. Oh, I got some XP for that. There as you well. go. Well done. Actually got. I'm going to be a, a healer for a bit. Let's go and save everyone's life. There's a few other guys. There's a guy lying down here over here you missed, Jules. 
Jules. Yeah, back in the same place, lying down. Oh, hey, Jules. Oh, there's another there's dwarf here as well, Claude. You gotta heal up everyone with your Claude, magical ring. Can you hear me? Where am I? Why am I? Am I lost? Oh, there I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, Jules. Yeah. <laughs> in an instant, my rune, my runes have all vanished. Good, good job, Jules. How do they not have access to these spells? I don't know. They're idiots. <laughs> they're, all, they're all sorcerers, right? It's a lot of them are, or at least they're selling books that teach you stuff. <laughs> You'd think they had someone who could use an undead healer slash spit. <laughs> Just because it doesn't work on you doesn't mean it's like it's like a human. It's like a normal human using a poison spell. Do you know what I mean? Mm. It's not that it's not that weird. So kind, of kind of magic. <laughs> there is a dwarf in the camp. We'll remove the colors. Yeah, people are saying this. Am I am I an idiot? Dwarf? Yeah, I'll have a quick wander around. There's a dwarf here that I can heal. Claude. Yeah. Heal him. You healed me. How did you? Well, I use magic. Uh, say it was the least you can do. There we go. Yeah. These shriekers. Those magisters are going to pay in blood for what they did to us. Good job. Good job, Good. Dunk. Good. Thank you, Claude. Saved him. Uh, healed. Oh, we've got lots of ring recipes. I know. I just learned. I just did a crafting, by a crafting thingy. I'm going to switch to uh, wand and shield. And I'm make a primitive more, harpoon. More Oh, cool. If I combine a long branch with a sharp stick. I feel like a lot of these things are not useful to us. Just throwing that out there. I've got a lot of magic and armor now. Like, a lot. With the shield on. <coughs> How much? 109 physical armor, 127 magic armor, and 217 health. Oh my god, look at all these recipes. Whoa! We just learned how to make all the foods. Porridge, mashed potatoes, fish pie, dough. Does it show which ones you have um, ingredients for? Yeah, I don't have ingredients for any of them. Oh. Got a, I can make a cooking station, though, with a campfire and a cooking pot. Okay. So I guess I can just, like, sit down and do some cooking at any time. I've Maybe only got human and elf faces. I really want some lizard faces. See, actually, I need... I can do some of them if I have a boiling pot. But a lot of them... Yeah. Right. A boiling pot. To Elven stew. I can put dinner in and tomato sauce. Dinner and tomato sauce makes Elven stew, Duncan. Very complicated. Dinner yeah. and tomato sauce. What? It's any dinner? <laughs> any dinner. With ketchup. Hey, and tomato. <laughs> Ridiculous. Okay. Crafting is a silly thing. Lady. It is a silly thing. Alright. Get to try some new spells out. She sells Aerithurg stuff. Right. So I learned chloroform, Ooh. which lets me like put people to sleep. I feel like I'm not gonna use it. <laughs> I feel like it might be worth me just putting one one level into huntsman just so I can get tactical retreat. Yeah. And we can both be blinking everywhere. Yeah, I mean, it's always powerful. It's a very powerful spell. Because of Lone Wolf, I don't only have to put one level into it to get the two points you need. I don't... Yeah, maybe you do. Once for two. Did you, did you buy Heart of Steel? Because you've got Polymorph now. I only got, you only got one level of Polymorph, though. Yeah, I should have got part Heart of Steel, maybe. It's quite good, like, regen. Hmm. Do you want to get it for you? Nah. Sure. I'm right. All right. But I've not got. I'll I'll play around. I'll probably respec at the end of the island and yeah. decide what I like best and what seems to work. It's worth just muck mucking around seeing what I actually use. Um. So I'm not really. I could do with a, another memory skip. Really. I want to want to give lots of things a go. Can I uncheck? Oh, I can. I don't need bless learn because I can't use source point. Teleport. Cloak and dagger. Teleport without breaking sneak. Oh, that is awesome. It does cost four points, though. 
Or is that a four turn cooldown? Oh, it costs one point, sorry. Yeah. Mm. It's so strong that skill. So you got loads, loads of uh, teleports now. Yeah, and tentacle squish. I can atrophy people with with a tentacle. That's cool. Okay, that that sounds like a, a cool thing to just be like teleporting all over the place. I just like licking people with a big tentacle, as well. I, I had that on my D and D character actually. I was like a teleporter. I had. Um, oh, I thought you said ten I thought you meant tentacles. No, I had like. Because I was a conjurer, I had all these different things I could do. I could just blink in, blink out, have other things. I was a uh, what's it called? A conjurer. A Eladrin. So I had like a teleport from that as well. The beach down here. Right. Let's go and do something, Lewis. Yeah, do you want to do something? Yeah. Let's go. Should we go to do that maze? Hmm, there's a dead magister down here. Oh dear. Beach. Mm. Uh, blah blah blah, blah 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 blah. Right, Let's, should we go and uh, do that maze? Because that lo that looks pretty fun. Yeah, I reckon I could probably cheese it as well. Yeah, you got all the blinks, and you can teleport me with you as well with your teleport skill. I reckon there's some like treasure down here on the beach or something. There usually is, right? You, you're the one that finds a treasure, I'm the one that digs it. <laughs> there's a fishing rod. I'm gonna go yeah. fishing. I'm gonna go fishing. How do you do that? Is that a thing? Ooh. Shit. Well, no. <laughs> Gives you all in. <laughs> it's a two-handed weapon, I'm guessing. Mm. <laughs> Maybe I need some points of wits to discover more treasure. Wits. Treasure. Yeah. We don't need treasure. We don't need nothing. Just wondering. Have you I, I like finding. Oh yeah. Have you looked at the um this thing yet? The the big face. It's a waypoint. Well, I just spooked some people because I'm undead. What? Oh, do you take your hat off? Apparently oh, I did. You did. You're fighting the town. Play dead. Hang on, can I just um, flee combat? Just play dead. Oh, yeah, I'll play dead. <laughs> do I have to click on myself? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I've just... Oh, this isn't good. This isn't ideal. How did the my hat come off? What happened? I don't know. And my gloves came off. What? Why did this happen? Your teleportation gloves came off. Yeah. Well. They okay. did again. I'm just gonna flee. Oh, you can't. I can. Oh, enemy's too close. All right, let's run away and flee. Do 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 do. do. And we'll go back to Hollow Marshes. <laughs> Okay, I'm out. How about you? I'm talking to the big face. Oh, you you weren't actually in combat? No. Oh, right. Okay, good. That's fine then. Uh, I just got blessed again. How did that... What happened, guys? I think. What happened to my... Exudes warmth and why, why did I lose all my... What, what happened in chat? What, why did I lose all my... Um, why did I take my hat off? What was that? Was I just swimming? Was it like... Is it because I got drunk? Man, I wasted that source point then because I just got free bless. Uh, anyway. I might have lost some attribute points. Oh. When I was drunk and that dropped my ability. Oh, yeah. Oh. I reckon I lost strength. Oh, right. And you had to put the items. And it dropped oh, that's my funny. items off me. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. The air you <laughs> Blessing oh well, I think I have minus 40 rep with certain people now, probably. Uh, well. I can always use the... Yeah, I do, I have minus 45 rep with these guys. Well, you're just going to have to do all the buying for me. Rip. Ripperoni. Okay. Have I gone somewhere else? Uh, this is yeah, I went north. Oops. Can I get through here? Where's the... North, I think that is just the way out, isn't it? No, anyway. it's not. It's a different way. Oh, yeah, it's the alternative way yeah. out. I can come this way. No, no we want to go south to get to the maze. No, there must be some loot around here, though. We'll, we'll find that place later. Where we have this this way to the maze. Yeah. Plus, we've got the um, waypoint here now, so. I think this is an alternate way in, though, to the. Yeah, the but we might, we'll probably get in that way again at some point. Yeah. 
I think it's just I think it's just a, a game where you can roam. Yeah. Yeah. But we might end up getting around there and I wouldn't normally have drank the ale, but it auto drank the ale when I picked it up. Oh really? Yeah. Rip. Duckard's playing Summony Boy, I'm playing Ranger Boy. But I'm kind of just fiddle faddling around, like with various things. But at the end of this thing, you can respect, so I might decide to go all one or the other. But because I'm, I'm sort of, you have to kind of pick which attribute you go into. So I'm mostly finesse. You want to go like Blinky Wizard, maybe? Well, oh. I don't want to put any points in intelligence, really, which means none of my wizard spells will do any damage. But you get to respect, though. Yeah, that's true. But I could like, um, but I don't want to put points in intelligence and finesse. I mean, I'd rather put intelligence. I'd rather. No, but I mean, I mean, I'd like rather put finesse and wits, and then learn like the support spells, like yeah, rain yeah. and stuff, and then you can just put points in intelligence, do all the lightning bolts and shit like that. Ooh, flamey shit! Oh my god, there's a bone totem. <gasps> just a oh, it's just a dragon. Do you remember the dragon? Oh yeah, the dragon's down here. We're we going to talk to the dragon. It's a prison. It's a slain the winter dragon who is soul shackled. Give us a bit of a, a quick save. Do you need to purging wand him? I can't remember. Maybe. Because I think he comes and helps you later, doesn't he? What's going on? In the hmm. end of battle. Hello, dragon. Give us a quick save. Let's see if you do it. Already. I have. Okay, good. Uh, oh, I didn't. I didn't put nails in my new boots. I better do that. <laughs> Yeah, probably does. Probably wouldn't hurt. Yeah, I can't remember what we what we do here. This guy looks super badass, though. He is. Shit. It's a winter dragon. I can just go over the ice. Look, I've got I've got spiky boots. Immunity to slipping. Mm. Yeah, he's like you see these these two bone totems. Should I talk to him? Yeah. The purge dragon, sauce and juice, blah blah blah. What earth is it doing chained up here? Talk to me. What do we do? Oh, he doesn't want to talk to you. We found a purge dragon. Uh, we can free him if we want, using by killing these two bone tomes, I assume. Now I think you either mm. do you just need to attack them, or I don't know. I just yeah. shot that one. Ah, it's still on one health. <laughs> the dragon the earth. Hello, dragon! Quakes from the impact, not <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have freed this dragon. Is it bad or good? He's a good dragon. He likes us. Dragons are always a risk. We just know? saved him, you know? He's going to be happy, isn't well, he? he? Could small My gratitude for your effort, friend. Yet I am no more free now than I was in those chains. Yes. Or well, sing me to the end of slumber. So we can we can choose to actually fight him or free him. Right. Check if we could kill him. <laughs> Do you want to give it a go? It's going to be a, a solid fight. Yeah, it will be a tough one. Should we, should we try it? I mean, I, last time I let him free, so I think maybe this time it would be fun to... The other thing, he might not actually. He might not actually fight us, though. I think we do. Uh, it's a form of a cryptic smile. <laughs> do not kill him, you heathens. <laughs> <laughs> uh. So the the witch Radica purged him. Her purging will may free him. He is free, but he still seems unwell. So we need to heal him, apparently, because he's still sick. No, it's because he's got this. He's got like a. We need to purge him. That's how you save him. Using her purging one, I shoot. We've got a purging one. This ours will do, I expect. You think? Oh. <laughs> there we go. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> Dragonfall. A fatal We're error. Gonna so die. Even without my what did he say? Even without my source, I am incredibly powerful. <laughs> did he just say? Oh my God! What's he doing? <laughs> We're gonna die, Lewis. You're. Yeah, I'm not looking super <laughs> healthy already. I'm actually being frozen. How many things can he do in a turn? 
I have been frozen solid. Your enemies are more powerful than you. Consider fleeing. <laughs> Understood. <laughs> we can always quick load if we die. Um, let us let's let's start with a, a incarnate. Well, let's go, no. Let's start with something even more fun than that. A blood rain. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now I can summon a blood incarnate. Boom. And give him some buffs. But we haven't taken any actual f health damage yet. No, but it's not going to be long before we do. <laughs> no, it's going to be almost instant. All right, now let's let's just start hitting him. Ah. Okay. Okay, that's a hundred damage. That's a whirlwind. Uh, he's trying to run away. Uh, what a fool. Ow, he just hit you for 56. All right. But you're fine. Okay, so let's get a totem down on the blood. Uh, I don't want to ha really have it on the whirlwind, do I? Hopefully, I'll get it far away from him. I can. Uh, there you go, blood totem. Do you want to... Bloated, anything I can raise as a corpse around here? No, I think you want to fortify yourself because you've run out of armor. Yeah, I can, well, I can shields up. That's for two. I can... Shields up seems to work, but also fortify. Decent. 40 physical. Yeah. And I've got this as well, armor of frost. Yeah. Which well, is magic armor. Well, I would suggest that will be good And idea. fortify is regular armor. So I've got... Four, I, can, I can do shields up. And then I can do fortify. And then I can do armor of frost. I can be a tank. Jesus Christ. That is <laughs> a lot of stuff. And then it's your champions go. Okay, so... Are we now killing a dragon? I hope so. That would be great. Do another 120 damage. Ish. Okay, now it's his go. He gets a hundred thousand things to do. But after you get his armor down, you can like knock him over and stuff. So you can keep you can use a knockdown arrows a lot. I haven't actually had a You're go. Gonna You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Oh my god. Well, I haven't had a go. Okay. Because what he I? started off by freezing me, and now I'm still frozen, and <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be able to help. I think you're just gonna have to kill him on your own. I, I can raise you a bloated corpse. <laughs> That'll be useful. <laughs> More blood totems, sure. Can we do this? Um, what's good against frost? I don't really know. Fire. Again, I haven't got any fire. Can I use this haste scroll on you? I think it's worth using on yourself, if anyone. At least it gives you more action. I just want you to be able to do stuff. I've used haste on you. I don't think that's going to help. And I don't get a go until after he goes again. Really? <laughs> yeah, look. This seems bonkers. It's because I'm skipping goes because I'm frozen. Oh. Well, well, let's see. Okay, his armor's down, so we can knock him down now. So I'm going to use, I'll use battering ram on him. Here we go. Knocked him down. Oh my god. Yes. Okay, he said that. So he's back up. He's back up, but he wasted his turn. So now you get a go. Oh my god, I can drink a poison bottle and I can get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of here, yo. Get some distance and just start shooting him. Yeah. Oh, he's dying, Lewis. <laughs> he's bloody dying. Use knock down arrow if you can. Oh, yeah. Oh, you didn't. I didn't. I should have done. Okay, that's fine. Get another blood totem. <laughs> Why are we killing Slay? Because we can. <laughs> I feel like... I feel like... That tactical like, can retreat. Can I take a yeah. knock down arrow? I tactically retreated, like, just behind it. Oh, man. You should have knocked him over. It's going to be bad now. Um... I can't take one of your knockdown arrows. You're gonna cut his face off. I want to cut his face off. <laughs> uh, what can we do here? 
all these scrolls. Oh, you could cast Fortify on me, which might keep me alive. Why didn't you just knock him over? Well, I didn't realize. <laughs> I just completely forgot that I have a million cool yeah. abilities that I never use because we never normally fight anything hard. <laughs> Yeah, give me some armor. Protect, <laughs> protect me. We literally have the purging one for killing him. Okay, I'll give you I'll give you a fortify then. Cast skill. Where are you? I'm over there behind him. Behind him? Well, I can't reach you. Oh shit. Uh, well, don't worry about it then. I'm gonna move. We need to spread out, I think. That's what we need to do. Then he can only kill one of us at the same time. Yeah. I'll, I'll give him some. Give him some. Magic damage isn't going to really do anything. I'm going to haste myself. No, no, fuck it. Just hit him. Why not? Man, take that. Blood type shoot him. <laughs> oh my god. And then the incarnate goes. <laughs> this is so crazy. Oh my god, he's just going to punch him to death. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's mad as hell. He's mad at me. Gotta kill you. <laughs> Frost breath. <laughs> Ow. I'm not actually dead though. Go on, have a turn. Nope, I'm there dead you now. go. <laughs> okay. He does a lot on his goes. <laughs> oh. Jesus. Alright. Okay. Well, you're dead, uh, so I just. Uh, I'm gonna. Shields up again. He's got fuck all physical health though. You just punch him a couple of times. I don't have. I got a wand on though. Just to re-equip. Just equip your bow. Or no, like or everything else will kill him. Summon a totem. I got another totem down. They'll just do it, take it to pieces. You soloed this guy. <laughs> <laughs> you really did. Like, but you you tanked for me though. That's the thing. You took a lot of damage for me. I don't know if I did. You're at full health. Yeah, exactly. Because no one attacked me. He's dead. Ridiculous. <laughs> we killed Slain! We Slain was <laughs> slain. You slayed the winter dragon. Great. Great job, everyone. Cool. Oh my god! Got a ring. Identified two handed mace. Oh, yay. And a summon oily blob. Got a summon, but it's polymorph. Oh. Summon oily blob. <laughs> Oh fuck, I really want to learn that now. Oh, Fang man. of the Winter Dragon, a one-handed sword. That's pretty cool. Strength, intelligence, warfare, and hydrosophist. Jesus Christ. Wow, let's have a look at what that this is. That is a lot of loot. Identify. Lore Master level two low. You need to learn another Lore Master. Lore Master level. two. For all these things. Okay. I guess that's the next level. Points. Did you level up from that? Uh, yeah. Did you? I think I did. Yeah. I'll go and rescue. you. <laughs> like. I'm gonna put a point in polymorph. Another point in polymorph. Then you can use that thing. And I summon. can use summon oily blob. Yeah. And also, I can use the bloody flying thing. Flying skill. Spread your wings. Sprout temporary wings to fly when you move. Which obviously is pretty that is interesting. amazing. Uh, so, Aerith Surge I have from gear. And so does, so does that. Summoning Necromancer. I'm going to pop one in Hydrophist. Okay. Go. It's crazy having one character. Summon Oily Blob. Does, it, does your oily blob get better when you're level 10? Damage is based on your level and receives bonus from strength, right? So, I mean, I don't think polymorph is the one for me. I think it's more of a strength-based yeah. thing. But I'll, I'll play around with it while I have it. Oily blob. Can I get his face? Let's try. Okay. Let's try and get his face. Oh, I can't get his face. <laughs> How ter how tragic. <laughs> so we slain a dragon before we got off the first island. That feels pretty good. Yeah. 
Jesus. <laughs> People in chat are so angry at us. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I'm not surprised. <laughs> God, he was so straightforward as well. There's a witch nearby that got in prisoner. She's down here. <laughs> we need to go and kill her next. Okay. <laughs> well, the way we're playing this game is so weird. It's the only dragon you will meet. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm I'm glad we killed him. I think it's yeah. Bring I, it I've off. never done that before. Oh shit! There's a big cave. Can you want to give a it's quick? It's like skull. Man, now we can't go back. <laughs> 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 oh my god! Duncan loves dragons. Duncan RPs as a dragon yeah. in World of Warcraft because you've got your. I can be. I've got a, the soul of a dragon attached to one of my weapons. And I can't Careful, this is it. a trap here, Doug, can you see? Oh no, not poison! Yeah, but I think... <laughs> there's also explosive bomb traps here. It's alright, I can shoot them from afar. Mirage mines. And that didn't really do much. Oh, you're, you're in trouble though. You alright? <laughs> New. I'm bleeding, I'm burning him. How are you not... Have you got like shit armor or something? Oh. What's... What's your what's your actual magic armor looking like? What's the number? Hover over it, the bar, the bottom. The bar. Sixty-four. Oh man, your armor's garbage. Magical armor, sixty-four. What's yours? One hundred and twenty-seven. I've got one hundred twenty-seven magic. Well, I am armor. wearing a shield. This this is horrible. Use a bedroll. Or just stand in this this uh, delicious poison for a bit. We need to turn off this thing in the middle. You see this trap? Just shoot it. Right click. Oh, wait. Yeah, your range. Right click and shoot it. No, but that's not how it works. Oh. Perhaps destroy it. It doesn't right. work like that. You have to turn it off. Just walk over it. I should neutralize. <laughs> Just keep going. It doesn't matter, though. It doesn't do much damage. Just run past it. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. All right. Fine, fine, fine. <laughs> you can heal up in the poison cloud. There's off. a lot of these bits. We looted everything in here. This is her bloody cave. The wrecky oh, this there. was a hard fight. I remember this being very hard. We just killed a dragon. <laughs> yeah, it's true. You want me to talk to her and you can summon up a load of crap? Yeah, sure. What right. is this place? What is this place? Isn't there like some hot lights? Like, yeah. Rakida. Yes, Rekida. this is life. There's my only blob. Oh, I like it. The woman turns right, let me know when you are talking again. Yeah. yeah. That was some... I don't have any blood there. Let's get some blood, blood on the board. <laughs> She's, I think, terrifying. Uh, I think... She stands to her full height. Her lips pursed in disappointment. Yeah. She's like some sort of terrifying... <laughs> She pets the bitch you're too late. Looks like Rose Witch. Alright, I'm ready to go. She's trying to kiss me, Duncan. Don't let her. She's kissing me. Oh no! I'm trying to push her off, but she's still kissing me. Bye. <laughs> right, got five rounds left to incarnate. So there's like, I remember having to retreat so from this So there's carrion beetles, so there's much. like all sorts of bad stuff here. Alright, I guess I'm going to just retreat up to here. And then shoot something. Which one should I shoot? Are you going to be right down there on your own? I don't know, probably not. But, you know, I've got my shields up and all that stuff. And I've got the incarnate with me. I'll be fine. Here's an oily blob. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> you 30 health. Uh... I'll buff you as well. This uh, this fight I remember was super hard. I tried this for hours, and I had basically the way I did it was be retreating to the edge, and before someone died, I'd just retreat them from battle. Right. Oh Until, god. And then I had, to come, I, think I had to come back in, and like when half the stuff was dead. Oh man, it was awful. Um, let's give myself some armor frost. And some fortify. Also, auto fortify the 
Carn as well, actually. Oh my god, that fortify gave you 80 physical armor. Did it? Yeah, because you were on 100 before, and now you're at 2. Oh no, I use armor. Oh no, that's magic. I was on. Yeah, my you're god, on 100, now you're on 191. It must just be the geomancy. It must the tooltips just can't be right because that gave you way more than it said. You're so tanky. 200 of each armor. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad, is it? The fuck. Is that a bloody corpse? It is a bloody corpse. I can get some bloated corpse in the go soon. Actually, once I kill something. They're already corpses. Exactly. Oh, my oil thing, boys, on fire. Whoa, it's dead. But it exploded, which is good. Oh, my oil thing exploded. Mm, that's sad. My oily flog. Rip. Oh, it shows the numbers before the lone wolf bonus. Which apparently you get a bonus. Right. Keep looking crazy because you. Well, Madat just burned to death. For old Madat. People are saying that you're bad because you have no, no warfare points. Warfare's just going to give you more damage, though. Oh, my damage is fine, but yeah. I'm just. You know, I guess the fact that you're holding a shield, plus you cast Armor of Frost and Fortify on yourself at the start of the battle, gives you 100 armor base, plus 100 extra. Mm. Whereas I'm just wearing normal just clothes. i put my incarnate. I've probably got the same armor as you, but because I'm not wearing a shield and I'm not buffing myself with those yeah. spells, I'm a bit squishier than you. Bloated corpse! Bloated corpse! So Madat's just coming back. I'm gonna poison it as well. There we go. Hey. Not a bad idea, is it? What else can we do? We've got one action point. Guess I'm gonna. Can I power. No, that's all we've done already, okay. Bloated corpse, go and get her! Squash, not gonna get this beat. Carrying beetle first. Okay. Not bad actually, is he? Does dirty damage. You can't complain, can you? Yeah. That guy's dead. This guy's doing a kiss. This disease, so. my blood totem. How dare he? Killed it. Punched it to death. All right. I get these like beetles. They're the they're, they're nastiest, nastiest egg. Lewis, you want finesse, wits, constitution, huntsman, and warfare. Yeah, I think so. Oh! What? Oh, when I summoned the bloated corpse, my incarnate went away. <laughs> oh! Ah, so I can't have more summons. That's news to me. That <laughs> feels bad. That's not good. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be going into necromancy. <laughs> oh well. You live and learn! <laughs> you do. I only have one summon at a time. I did not know that. Okay, that feels pretty rough. Yeah. To learn that the hard way. On this fight, especially. But I actually, it's cooled down, so I can just cast it again. Oh, you summoned it early enough. Mm. Right. Well, we can always respect. Like, this is why. Yeah, yeah. This is, this is the island where we're going to try stuff out. Oh, God, island. you got charmed. So I think I can break that using peace of mind. But unfortunately, I wasted peace of mind at the start. Are you going to summon your yeah, I'm gonna, other boy? Yeah, I think I'll make it a blood one again. What's wrong with fire? Well, physical damage... You can fireball up the cliff to kill her. I just feel like physical damage is better. It might be. Also, that deals she's got, with the she's charm got 70, thing. Well, 60 more physical, uh, magic armor as well. It's true. Plus, it combos with your, um, your bow. Okay. Oh, Blue corpse is dead. Um, yeah, well, I, like, that's good though, because it was charmed by them. They charmed it. Oh, they did? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> they're useful. <laughs> so we've got an extra action point. Oh, well, I'll use it to move. You could save and you'll get, like, get it back next turn. Nah, fuck it. All right, what can I do? Let's do a battering ram. Can I get to her? No, I can't, but I can get to this dude. Block. I feel like that's just a great movement ability. Yeah, because he's so slow to move around anyway, so it's good to hit him to move around like that. There is a corpse attacking you. Good luck. <laughs> oh no. Um, 
I guess we just start shooting again. Oh, it's not quite dead. It's quite random, the damage. Hmm. Oh, now he's dead. Now he's dead. Blood totems hit so fucking hard. They hit harder than you do. Alright, <laughs> oh, it's my go again. This is why you need warfare. I don't know. I don't. I feel like I feel like we're already pretty pretty OP. Yeah. Without me maxing too much. Ow. What happened to you? You reflected it. <laughs> I think he has like a, a damage reflect on him. Uh, right. I just kind of. Well, she's up there, so we need to kill her, I guess. Bonk. Bonk. Oh, that's a zombie. Punching you, but you've got so much physical armor that it's just no I effect. I got shields up as well. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! Can I attack her. Half is interrupted. Okay. It feels like your abilities you've chosen are pretty, pretty powerful. Armor of frost seems pretty good. Fortify seems pretty good. You know, they both seem like reliable abilities that. I don't know if they scale off your intellect. Uh, don't know. They scale off something. They must do. Doesn't seem to. It also cures burning poison, stunning, frozen, suffocated, petrified, on the frost, and fortify cures bleeding, burning, acid, decaying, poison. Can I teleport over? Hello. Oh, that's unfortunate. Lone Wolf is good early, but makes the game very hard later on. Oh. Good. That's maybe more. <laughs> I want that. We'll go from one extreme to the other. Where did she go? I died. You died? I pretended to die. Oh, where did she go? She's, oh, she's still up here. there. Okay. Good. Just bonk her twice. Bonk. Might actually kill her. Yep. <laughs> You're dead. It's just a corpse alive down there now. Rip. Holy fucking shit, Duncan. This is on normal difficulty. Yeah. Uh, corpsey corpse. Oh god. Okay. This looks good. Your turn. You can finish her off. Him off. Oh, well, I can get the. Uh, I, can, I mean, I'm allowed to. It's up next to me, the, in the fire. I'm gonna let you do it. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm gonna let you do it. Give him a free attack. On. Sorry, I was checking my. Uh, I just, sorry, I got a ping. I'm just checking my email. Um, all right. Damn. Right. Um. Boss fight over. Go and see what she's got. Racketer. Do you want me to get it? Yeah. She's got... Ooh, blood rose. Yeah, this blood rose thing. It's weird. So you just eat it to get those stats, do you? Yeah, I'm, I'm sure it was something else before. So another purging one. Her Second purging, purging wand. wand. Look at that wand. Infect. Oh, I could learn that, I guess. Uh, oh, a water, water wand. I'll take that water as well. Wand. An unidentified one-handed sword, an unidentified amulet, oh gosh, got some amazing unidentified loot. leggings, and some gold. There you go. Wow. Okay. Let's see. I think you need to be in charge of looting. Um. Uh, ah, Lawmaster one. Okay, that's good. Identify. They are. Uh, two leadership, one constitution. Do you want? Do you want these legs? They're pretty, pretty nifty. Two leadership. Hmm. That's a, what some one of us should use him if he's got two leadership in. I think Shit. I'll send them to you. You need some more armor. Pants of benediction. Oop. It requires finesse eleven. Oh well, yeah, yeah, sure. Amulet. Identify. Finesse scoundrel airy surge and magic armor. You can't wear it yet, right? Soon though, I'll send that to you. There you go. The womb. Oh my god. One Amulet called the womb. I've already got a pretty badass amulet, actually. Have you? 
You can't wear it though, can you? You've got the neck. No, I can't. I've got it prepared though for future. Oh, what is it? This one, the uh, Amulet of the Void. Oh, right, yeah. Okay, something about the wound then, and I'll wear that. Might as well. Well, mine gives me an intelligence, but a lucky charm. Fishing rod. Screw it. Screw it. What else we got? Is uh, can't you do that yet? Can't do that yet. Learn infect. <laughs> what does it do? I don't want to. I get rid of the bloated corpse then, because that's useless. Infect deals physical damage. Infects target disease. That's really good. Well, it means poison doesn't kill him. It means healing will, but then again, you're not really like a hydrosophist, are you? You're not really super like. No, I just took it for the armor and frost. Yeah, I think just give it a go. Fact, like, that's better than blow court, which is. Wow, this fight was just very straightforward, wasn't it? The blood roses. I mean, I'm sure there were like. So there's something here, isn't it? She was doing something creepy with these things. We need to get another point in Law Master. We need to level up again. <laughs> Well, that will come in time. Yeah. Just just to carry around a shit ton of unidentified things for a bit. <laughs> Fang of the Winter Dragon. That's pretty cool. Until you learn how to, like... Maybe I'll go melee. Since I got so, I'm so tanky, I can help my Karna out. But then I don't have strength to do damage, so probably won't be very good. Is, there, a, is there an intelligence-based melee weapon? Yeah. What is it? Staff, surely. Or no, like, that's ranged. Oh, that gives you staff of Magus. I, I feel like, I feel like you're okay. I feel like you probably should. I, you I need don't the know. rose to free the dragon. Oh, right. <laughs> we killed the dragon. Staff and our melee. Okay. I do have a crappy staff. I mean, I, I kind of want to use this cool ass sword. Though. That's why I asked. Fuck it, dude. Do whatever you want. <laughs> Duncan, honestly, at this point, I don't think it's going to make any difference. A lot of the time, you have, like, um, free turns, free actions anyway, mm. right, where you're not doing anything. You can always respec at the end of the zone if you if you don't want to use that. So you could put some points into strength for a bit, fuck it, and then take People them out. People are telling us how to free the dragon. We killed the dragon. The dragon's dead. We, we, we actually it. have murdered the poor dragon because we're monsters. <laughs> um, that has been done. That is a thing that's been done. The dragon's way. Oh. Shit. So one way to get off the island is for the dragon to fucking fly us off it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit embarrassing, isn't it? <laughs> no, because that can't be right, because there's the whole boat thing. You've got to have the boat. No, there's loads of different ways off the island. Yeah, but how do you... But then you start on the boat. Because you have... That's where all the respect stuff is. Oh, well, that's another way. Maybe he'll fly us to a boat or something. I don't know. He'll fly us to a, a boat waiting offshore full of the good guys or whatever. I don't know. Maybe he just flies us to the boat. Yeah. The only thing he does is killing... The, I, I remember reading that, and I think I freed him before, and I asked him to get me off the island, and he was like, No, can't do that. There's a tortured woman here who's decomposing. Ah, I'll get her face. I feel like... Um, we should save them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just saying, they've already been through enough. I feel like also their face is probably going to be decomposed. Where is she? Up here, up this ramp. Where? I don't see her. Up this ramp here. Oh. Oh. Such oh, I'll, I'll heal him. What happened here? He died, but at least he's cured. Wow. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, because he's diseased, the healing does damage. Oh, well, he was decomposing. We try a uh, poison dart, maybe? Yep. So some of the Seekers are being crucified by <laughs> some of these people. He died. I'll try poisoning him. Um, he died. <laughs> she died. All right. Hmm. <laughs> what should I try next? <laughs> Blood rain. Can't you? Can't you just? Try, try blessing. Can't you just free these guys? <laughs> oh, 
Oh dear, he is. I, I could bless him probably, but that's another source point that I'd be wasting. This is pretty rough. You Who's this random guy? This is me and you talking, by the way. Oh, right. These magisters, they'll get their comeuppance. They sure bloody will. Who's this guy here? I'm just going to put them out of their misery, you know? Bonk. Oh, this one had loot. No. He can't heal them. Yimit. Oh, they're all dead now. <laughs> I wouldn't worry. <laughs> Should you... Do you want to try the purging wand? I... I I've killed them all. Amazing. I mean, I'm not going to waste one of the purging one charges. But how much are we going to have to purge? All the Shriekers, because we don't have the dragon anymore. Because yeah, the dragon kills a lot of the Shriekers. Well, maybe you should have tried Bless. You can't save them, says Chowder. Oh, oh fine. Oh, I feel bad. Eh. I feel bad for those I'm going to get some of these faces. Oh, there's a lizard face. I think there's a lizard. <gasps> My first lizard face. You are I'm a monster, aren't I'm you? I'm excited. I haven't got a lizard face yet. Yeah, ripped off lizard face. Cool. Hmm. Did you get the tyrant set? No, not yet. We've got two pieces of it. I don't know. We haven't done the maze yet, have we, Louis? No. I, mean, I think this is coming up towards the end, honestly. This is where the boss is. Well, we and the shriekers. Well, yeah, there is a boss here. Should we go back and do the maze? Or should we just keep maze? going? Maze? I don't know. I think we sh maybe we should just get off the island, man. Like, we haven't done it before, so... There's also a shrine here we can get teleport to. Hmm. Isn't there, like, a super end boss? Five million coming up. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Okay, fine. Let's Where's go Gareth? Gareth. Oh, yeah. Gareth's up at the Bracchus Rex's place. Up at this temple here. Do you see that? This temple? Oh, really? Should go and save him first? Let's go and save him. Then we can get your collar off. Oh, yeah. I probably wouldn't hurt to get my collar yeah. off. It's priorities, Duncan. Priorities. Yeah. God, we, we're, we're just absolutely awful, aren't we? We've you totally moyed at so many of these folks on this place. We're horrible undead skeletons. What do you expect? Oh, look, there's another... Oh, there's a drained one. Oh, oh Magister Loke here has been permanently blinded. Oh, dear. What is this? Some oh. sort of weapon. Uh, a young permanently blinded. Yeah. you got to talk him round. Because he thinks we're attacking him. Well, he is a Magister, Lewis. Oh, I see. He's actually a bad guy. <laughs> <laughs> but he's I mean, he doesn't... He's are a we magister. literally going to kill a blind guy? He's a magister. They're all bad. <sighs> it's tough, isn't it? Oh, God, he's now in a bad way. Well, okay. Got him. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Didn't even summon anything. I got a letter. Let's see what the letter says. It's probably like to his wife. <laughs> My dear boy, we are making you something awful today. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, I think it's from his, his mum. I feel so much safer knowing that they took the sorcerers to Fort Joy. It's on page two. P.S. Hi, Jace. This is Le Ladia. I miss you a lot. Come back soon. I don't think he's coming back soon. There were some terrifying monsters on this map. Do you remember? And there's also those pigs that are on fire. Yeah, I haven't found those yet, have we? There's a dead bear here. Sure. I'm just going to take an animal hide off this bear. <laughs> now, this is the... Hmm. The rat. I'm just going to pop down here. <laughs> Terrifying monsters are you! <laughs> Can you teleport me over? Oh, you don't need to. Uh, there's nothing down here, actually. It's not... Sometimes you can get exploration XP from... from oh, there's, is that a treasure chest down there? 
Uh, let's see one. It's quite weird. Uh, no, right. Might have to just come back. I could, I've got so many teleports now, I can just sort of jump. Jump across to places. Oh, maybe there isn't anything over here. This is a waste of time. Right. Cool. That was a waste of time. Three teleports. I could teleport myself and you. Yeah. What's this dead bear all about? Do you not find the cub somewhere or something? I remember that. Oh, a bear cub. And then you're like, your mum's dead, mate. And your then mom. he comes and finds her, and then he's like, just mega sad. Most dangerous when cornered. Gareth went looking for weapons. He hasn't returned. The seeker Gareth is missing. Okay. Battle rage in a ruined castle. So yeah, there are they are over here, Duncan. Let's go and this fuck place. them up. You sure you're ready? <laughs> yes. Oh, I can persuade them. You've got more flesh in your bones than the last visitors. Um, you, have you looked at me? <laughs> have you looked at me? Um, just screw them. Oh, shit. <laughs> screw it. I was going to... Right. Well, they're straight in on us here. All right. Your turn. I think a nice big fiery carnet will do... Great work here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some blood ring down for all this fire. Okay. I'm going to make a blood ring. Okay. Yeah. That's a good combo, I think. Do you feel like the blood incarnate is like very, very good? Well, it's the one. It's, it's, a, it's the only physical one that isn't just regular, and it gets a, a heal that you can like, you can, like a heal that you can use as well. Which is good. What's this guy's armor at? 85. Okay, let's go knock him, knock him for six. Bonk. I suppose it does work better with me because what, I'm yeah. not doing any magic. Yeah, so well, I don't if, we, if we respec and you do magic damage, then maybe I'll start switching it up. But I mean, I can just grab the blood that you leave around and do even more physical yeah. damage. I feel like it's a good combo. I mean, that is like a lot of damage there. Mm. I need to really get up the hill somewhere. Hmm. It's tricky. Like, I can't easily, because you can't see upstairs mm. sometimes, and that bit of upstairs just happens to be on fire. Ah. <laughs> wasn't, wasn't covered by the blood, blood rain. didn't put it out. I could go up there anyway. And then... You're hasted. Why are you hasted? Because I uh, tactical retreat hastes. Oh, cool. Oh god, crossbow boy. Man, that hurt. Oh. He's dead. Idiot. Why do they suicide? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's really funny. They should know. <laughs> do they think it's going to be dodgeable? How many times has he missed? Never. He <laughs> doesn't miss. Um, man, that's ridiculous, isn't it? What's my armor looking like? Totally fine. Let's get myself a fortify. I could just tank for us as well. It's like it's so much armor and health. I got a leader in sight buff because now you have leadership too. I get plus all these extra things. Look, plus yeah. dodging and resistances. Yeah, which is not bad. What's this? Everything Infect. is everything is six percent. I'm gonna stronger. infect this this dude. Wait, no, this dude. You like works of magic armor. Oh, it does apparently. What did it do? Just poison him? Oh, it is because it does 70 damage first and it infects him. Oh, that was it did 70 damage, so yeah. it got rid of all of his magic armor. Yeah. No, it's physical armor. It's physical damage. That's why I picked it. What? Yeah. The fuck? 70 physical damage from range. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, I've got 25 intellect, or 27 intellect now. Oily Blob! Oily Blob, go! He's infected. I shouldn't have probably done that. <laughs> he got infected by the, the plague that I've cast. Cool. More? Sure. Alright, Oily Blob. Do it. Go, Oily Blob! Yeah! Oh, he missed. <laughs> oh, oh! I thought I'd have thought that would have hurt him because he's infected, but it doesn't. 
guess that's not what it does. So I guess each character can have their own summon out. So you've got this super beef boy. Yeah. I've got Oily Blob. AKA the worst one. He's all right. He explodes in fire when he dies, which is kind of cool. Or if he dies in fire, I guess. Bone Widow. <sighs> so Bone Widow used to be a really, really powerful necromancer spell. But apparently it's like... Well, I mean, you, 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 you wouldn't be able to use it. It would be like bloated corpse, right? Yeah. Whoop. <laughs> Didn't quite reach him. <laughs> Bone Widow is incredible. I like the Incarna. He's a beast. Uh, oh, there's a guy right here. I didn't even know. He's got my Incarna away. Yes. Oh, he shielded. Oh, my turn. Uh, who's he? Where, where, who's still alive from where? They're kind of hard to see, aren't they? This guy down here, I guess. It's always, it's always annoying to like shoot over. I've always found this very difficult in this game that like high ground, once you have it, it's nice, but maybe, maybe later on in the game, if the incarnate actually starts dying, having like a bone widow and then I can like alternate their cooldowns. Oh, I see, you summon the, the, the one yeah. guy and then you, once he's dead, you summon the next guy. Yeah. Yeah. Might be a good idea. I think a necromancer summoner does sound quite fun as a, as a class combo. It does seem to work. Like, I mean, I'm yeah. hitting them for physical. You're, yeah, I'm hitting you can, physical. You can like summon things that do physical. I can get the blood, which gives me better incarnates and totems. Yeah, I know, Isaac, that's why I said it. Thanks. Thanks for the tips. Yeah. Not at the moment, though. Holy shit. Gone. There's no way he's ever fucking dying. No. <laughs> if he does die, you can just resummon. I know, but it's like a, it's like a, a long cooldown on it. So if he dies really quickly. See, he's yeah. dead now when he tries to move away. Yeah. Which he will, because he's ranged. Um, um, what's left? I <laughs> Reckon he says. So I think there is like another group of them upstairs, like fighting with. No one else needs to die. Yeah, there's another group up here fighting Where? with old. Um... Oh. Fighting with. Um... Up through there. Yeah, we need to go up and save him. Okay, let's go. Oh, there's dudes left here. I, I didn't realise. Yeah, sometimes it's hard to tell. Who was where? Especially when they're just a big fireball disguised in the fire. <laughs> Magic shell on. Alright, cool. Let's just shoot this guy to death. Or not, because I need to move forward ever so slightly. Yep. I mean, the bows feel like. Look at this. Like, it feels like the. Look at the range, though. Look how close I have to be. I still can't shoot him. Duncan have a shield bash. It's a warfare skill that scales based on shield bash. I don't have shield bash. No. How do I get that? It's a warfare I don't have any skill. points in warfare, so. Why can I not shoot this guy? Uh. <laughs> I don't know. What kind of ground is this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got him. Can we, can we kill him? Oh, nearly. On three. Surely you're good. Oh, yeah. It's all right. There we go. This guy's got 50 health. He's in smoke. That's why you couldn't see him. He was in smoke. Yeah. Amazing. Let me send this guy up here. Into the smoke. He's gonna come out of the smoke suddenly and here. Huh? A new fight. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I knew that there was a fight going on. There's a guy left over here still. No, you're in a second fight now. Oh. You went and aggroed another pack. Oh, I thought it was the same fight. <laughs> no, he's in a set. He's in his own fight now. He can't champion is now oh, in a complete. I'm gonna go up and help him then. Well, look, can we finish off this fucking fight with oh, this guy? He's on nine health. You can, you can take him out. There's two guys. I Don't take any actions with the other fight. Why not? 
What's happening? Just don't. Okay, don't don't do anything. Oh. Don't. Okay, it can't disappeared. Right. Oh god. I think well, either they killed it or it ran out. So the other fight is ended now, apparently. Well, that that fight is. What about this archer down here? What happened to him? Did you kill him? He died of like fire or something. Oh. He died on his own. Well, it... I think it was the blood tobes or something that killed him. Anyway. Okay, I'm gonna start summoning stuff into this. Into this don't screen. don't do that yet. Just wait till we've looted everything up. I feel like sorry. I, there's a problem. I remember when I did this before. He died, and so I didn't want that to particularly happen again. Oh, okay. Fighting tr triggering fights is a real weird part of this game, and it's very confusing. But basically. The way it sort of works is you can right, loot them up, loot them up. If you go out of like range of it, it can throw you into new ones or old ones, or, right? Or whatever. And also, you can sort of stealth your way into fights as well. Like you can go around the back. Well, like uh, there's smoke here, so I'm going to summon stuff into the smoke. Like if I try and go around the back, I'll fail. Obviously, there we go. Bam. I make, I make a smoke a smoke champion. Is that a thing? No, <laughs> apparently not. So now, okay, I'm in the fight, but you're not in the fight. Okay, I'll get in soon, once I've got this guy summoned up. Right, so go. I don't want to take actions, because... I'm going in. Okay, we're in, we're starting. Let's do this. Right. Save this guy. Sure. Let's just... Give myself some wings for fun. <laughs> Can you just fly around now? I think cool. I've got a new spell called Flight. Fly to a nearby point. That's cool. That sounds sounds fun. Literally always better to max warfare first. Apparently someone says. Sure. I just have wings. I just wing yeah. around. <laughs> Who needs warfare when you got wings? There we go. Look, I've got wings now. And then I just play dead. What happened? Am I not in the fight anymore? Your. Why is my incarnate ban banished? Did they like desummon it or something? Did it just run out? How long have you got on the cooldown? I think they've been like desummoning it. This is a very difficult area to fight in with all these trees yeah. and mess around. Okay, well, I haven't got a summon anymore. I didn't... Oh, the, com the incarnate didn't enter combat because it was in this fucking smoke. So when I moved forward, you I went. entered combat. But, but the then you was in But what you should have done was you should have controlled the incarnate to bring it into the I combat. I didn't realize it wasn't so it in. Gradually I just expired. assumed it went in automatically. Oh, well. Well, the, but this is why we need to learn this stuff. Yeah, these yeah. are, like, awkward. Like, these are, like, totally awkward. Yeah. So let's, let's leave the smoke. We had this problem quite a bit when we played it before. Fucking smoke! <laughs> Am I out of the smoke? Yes. I think we should be fine because where's your totems just do so much damage. That oh no, we'll be fine. No problem. My armor. You can do a maybe a course while you're waiting for the cooldown, right? Uh, that's. I need a body first, though, don't I? So I think I removed it from my memory slots because I got infected instead. I've just got so many teleports, it's weird. Is this game good? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Really good game. One's dead anyway. Here we go. Maybe, I think it might have been changed since I, we played it because this fight used to be a lot messier. There are a lot more enemies and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to infect Gareth, so I'm going to infect this guy, because he's an archer. He's unlikely to... Oh, I didn't. Oh, he did infect him. Yeah, he's unlikely to get close, is he? Um, we've got to finish things. We need, let's, uh, let's finish up this fight. Let's attack Magister Swordsman. Open up eight. Okay. End of town. Oh no, there's a lot of missing going on. Oh no, he can't that's regeneration on me. What an asshole. 
did he just... Okay, well, Gareth is here anyway. He's got an amazing moustache. He looks fucking good. He's a, he's a good guy. Gareth the man! He is the man. Salty bone man. He's also a man. Yeah, the freaking shot. Oh, two health. Man, you did a lot of damage there, though. Adrenaline. Bam. Oh. <laughs> That's disappointing. <laughs> that gives me two oh, AP. For yeah, free. yeah. But I lose two AP next turn. Yeah. So I could just, like, finish someone off, hopefully. <laughs> but in the case of that, I just missed. Oh, that's funny, though. All right, let's get this finished off. And not let anyone do any damage to me ever again. Got him. Okay. That guy's going to die to infect. Oh, I think someone had a totem. Well, just oh. end, your, end your turn. I think we've got this anyway, probably. Yeah. Even though you don't have your incarnate. Yeah, I, mean, I, could, I could summon it now, but... We're just killing everything. We've res we're gonna rescue Gareth. Gareth! And I think we're right next to Bracus Rex's like tomb place now as well. Because he is like, um, oh wow, I'm just like fractionally out of range of this guy. Target is out of sight. Is he in smoke? Is this, is this, uh, is this another yeah, smoke situation? Yeah, I think so. It's very annoying. Fine. <laughs> Well, 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 what do we have here? We have, what do we do here? Do we, can I get him out of the smoke somehow? Can I, my blood rain is not cooled down yet. Let's just, just summon a totem, move out the way. And a water balloon. It doesn't get right. rid of smoke, annoyingly. Why would water balloon get rid of smoke? Well, I just assumed it would. He's got 126 magical armor. Yeah. That's pretty beef. Yes. Well. I was hoping you would deal with him, but I have to realize <laughs> none of us can deal with him due to the fact that he is... Can you teleport him out of smoke? Yes, that's what I should... Well, I can't but see him. You can't him. see him. Oh. Maybe I should have those gloves since you've got the other, other teleports. Yeah, I've got so many teleports mm. now. How about... How about a blob? An oily blob. Well, it's so ridiculous that I can't see him. And I've, I've got no, I've no teleports. Nothing is up for me to be able to How fly over. How do you clear here. smoke? Is there a way to clear smoke? There we go. Guess we're just gonna do this forever. Miss. <laughs> just beat this guy up. We need like an auto, <laughs> auto yeah. button. Because I'm not going to do anything to him because just, I'm just doing physical. I, I, I don't really want to infect him because it will infect us. The thing is, this is like just one guy. We're on full health. He just needs to die. I'll poison him. There we go. So coming up next is the Hoy Boys. Um, we're going to have to end this stream very shortly. Yeah, let's save Gareth and we'll finish. Um, yeah. Tornado gets rid of it apparently, but it um, it's Torn quite late, late, late game. Tornado, smoke is like a weird status effect that I haven't really seen much of previously. It's what, it's what happens when the fire goes on its own. I think. There we go, we did it, we saved him. Bam! All right, I will quickly F5, and we have to go. Thanks okay. everyone. We'll be back next time uh, with more divinity. Yeah. We're going to talk to Gareth, and then we will. Get off the island next time. All right. See you then. Bye. Bye.